Lay on my Mars. Walking all over the beat, putting my feet on the stars. I rock it like Lenny, thinking like Jimmy the first time he seen a guitar. Standing in front of where they shot about us, and we gotta know who we are. Uh, I'm in rare form. Wearing red Jordan, straight from Air Jordan, this a fair warning. Too many young guards, beef over nothing. When you get money, you know that it's coming. Saying they homies, but they ain't a hundred. We the most hundred. Uh, I got my Mets hat on to the back. Y'all already know where we're going with the stats. Hall of Fame only, kings and queens only. They all be grabbing my style, but you know they can't hold me. Yeah, I'm in rare form. Y'all still on the ground, you know I've been airborne. Studying big, studying Nietzsche. You got a call on the chopper to reach me. Homie, I don't need a jeweler to freeze me. Ice in my veins, I make it look easy. Mentally, I'm in Queens. More money, more problems, you gotta be ready for all that it brings. Let them say what they say, revenge on my plate, I'm loving the taste. They see you shouting, emotions get hard to contain, they just not evolving the same. Me and HB is too rare, I'm moving all through the snares. Sound on billionaire, ain't nothing changed, I'm flipping the page, I'm prince on the stage, slave on the space, you know what they say, Katie the way, I'm staying rare for all of my days. I'm staying rare for all of my days. Tarantino, curbing my ego, even though he know, empty glass of Pino, cigars in casinos. I move on and seize, I just conquer and solve another rapper with ease. Cause I'm at my apex, another bar below, nothing but a milliliter. I'm a kilo, second to none, making MCs run, so don't try to step to me, cause I ain't the one. I believe rap just like and Tyler, already? and they know it. Hey, so I don't see why you all try to front, hey, yeah. perpetrating a stunt, when you know that I smoke you up like a blunt. I'm genuine like Gucci, raw like sushi, the stage of rage is what rap did to me, to make me want to create chaos and mayhem, cold rock a party. Until the AM, I'll make a muscle, grab the mic and hustle. While you stay the views, comments, and opinions of the following program do not necessarily reflect those of Morris Media Studios, MorrisMediaLive.com, or its affiliates. Listener discretion is advised. Did old girl, did old girl get a uh, spin off of that? Your no. Sheree? Because no, wasn't she? Um, she's on the show, right? We're live. We're on. Yeah, we're she on, was the. Um, we're on. She's the yeah. uh, so, showrunner. Co-creator. Sure. Your Sheree? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, we're on. Just said it. No, no, now. I know that. What? You know what's funny too? What? Her, the uh, we'll you know. my friend, um, <laughs> the lady that does the uh, costume for her. I went to high school with her husband. Oh, and they're very good friends. Yeah. Well, high school, a lot of dudes. I know that. Save it for your you second. Uh, <laughs> are we on? <laughs> on, 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 on. Hi, guys. We're on. Oh, oh my God. Whoa. That was friendly. No, Hi. She could whoa. say that. Uh, all right. We're right. gathered here to die on this m- yeah, <laughs> joyful occasion. Ran out of talent. Yeah. So, yeah. Wow. We, had, we had one line. <laughs> we had one line to do, Jeff, and you fucked it up. Quote TDP. <laughs> We're gathered here to die. Uh, 
Okay, hi, I'm Lewis Dix. On a softball hey, occasion. Hi, I'm Lewis Dix. <laughs> like Dom Lowe, Speedy. Yeah, Speedy. Hi, I'm Lewis Dix. I guess I'm Speedy. You don't know if you're Speedy or not? I didn't know this. I don't think oh, that's right, he was here. My bad. Speedy. <laughs> Oh, we gotta do it again. Yeah, right, see why the temptations broke up. <laughs> yeah. It's your boy Speedy. Teeter. <laughs> Jeff Arnold. Dan Green. What's the name of the show today? And hey, the man's world. Uh, uh, Speedy, you went right over his lines, right, bro. Speedy, yeah. You did the same thing. I was trying to help you out, Trip. Yeah, Damn. That worked out. Yeah. Damn. So we are like the hey, temptations. Hey, so Before we gave him on air, we were saying, but no, all right, can we do it again? cute right now. Yeah, all right. All right. Hi. Hi, I'm lopsided today. That's not talking good. too much. See, I mean, huh. it's no, no, it's cool. Whenever someone's talking, we just let them quiet, let them talk. Okay. And if it, 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 it either it's going to hit or it's not. And it's not hitting. It's really. like when you say this is funny. Yeah. And then it don't be right, funny. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. All right. Hi, I'm Lewis Dix. I'm Speedy. Teeter. Jeff Arnold. Dan Green. What's the name of the show? In a Man's World. Tighten up your belts. All right, ladies. We used to say get your, you know, make your sandwiches and all that, but you guys don't know how to cook, so now you mm. just, just order it. Uh, Uber, Uber Eats. Eats. DoorDash? I've never done DoorDash. I've never done Uber Eats. <laughs> I have. I can't believe really? he got a girl. <laughs> I just don't trust, well, Code 3 cooks. Oh. Okay. She cooks. She always has stuff in the refrigerator and cooks. So it's ready for you when you get home, regardless. <sighs> no, it's not all like that. I cook it. Mm. She doesn't know okay. how to season. You trust her cooking? She's struggling to season it. Yeah, she'll cook it, but I have to season it. Oh, okay. What is your wow. go-to seasoning? Yeah. Huh? What is your go-to seasoning? You said that out loud? Yeah. Well, she Wait knows that. Oh, We're right. honest with each other. So how does she know how to cook, but don't know how to season? I don't know. It's just that don't make sense. It's just something that Or it's just your palate with. the way you like it to be seasoned. She probably no, knows how to season it. No, Ooh, no, look at the big struggle. words. Palate. Palate. Mm -hmm. Palate's a big word. <laughs> she went to Costco. <laughs> some of my paper. Hey. <laughs> yes. I got a paper. Today. After you after you eat this, drink some milk. Kills your palate. See, that's why we got quiet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got to say, this is going to be funny. <laughs> I didn't say that with this time. As you say. <laughs> He thought it, and then he just. <laughs> <laughs> I give it to Dan. It goes here, and he goes. That's cool. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, that's that's, that's me. If it hits the brain, it's out. Yeah, you got to throw it out there. That's right. So, so someone that's... that watched the show last week was like, "Why did he have the thing on his face yeah, the so whole stupid. show?" Yeah, no, yeah. Wasn't he hot? Yeah. Put dummy, if on. I was hot, I could do it, huh? You should put it back on. You can put them hands up. We can put it back on. I'm just saying. Ooh. Oh, oh you want to fight everybody you. now? Huh? So everybody can get it this week. Mm. Actually, I got a, I got a surprise Stop for my segment though. too. Now, wait I got a, a surprise so for my your segment. Your birthday landed on what day? My birthday is Saturday. Oh, this Saturday. Yes. You had a, a little get together. Uh, I had a I had yesterday. a little party sh uh, comedy show last night. Oh. Sent it to us at three. And the party was at ten. Mm. Okay. You wouldn't come in no way. So. I thought about it. Nobody's y'all was... didn't come. It's cool. <laughs> no, I really did. Think I got about a good it. memory. I got to get up. I got to get dressed. <laughs> yeah, I got a great go memory. Like I'm I called myself. Lewis if he was gonna go. I he know, gave me this. I know. I understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand. No, and I, knew, no. I knew I had to put my watch day. on. It's a bit much right now. It's okay. Yeah, no, okay. that's all right. Uh, and I would have wore my good watch, not the other watch. Certain watches I wear. Yeah. You but know. then I thought I was like, ain't gonna be no bad bitches this. <laughs> Actually, wow. it was some bad bitches. Are you saying <laughs> Dennett doesn't attract? I'll just keep that to myself. Some white bitches. I know. Oh, well, you know they did. FedEx workers. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> FedEx was in the house. <laughs> delivery you know y'all wanted. You know you wanted to get with them delivery girls. You know that. Mm, okay. No. So before we came on air, we were talking. We we're like, oh, it's five of us. We're the Temptations, and then we said, which who is who. Which temptations are we? Now, a lot of the young people who watch the show probably don't even know the temptations. Google them. The people who are of age, go ahead and I like you know. I Street Boys better. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say New Edition. I was going to say New Edition, too. Why can't we be New Edition, man? No, we're the temptations. <laughs> no. It's on the paper. Because Lou knew he was going to be Ronnie. But you keep talking. We could go to Four Tops. <laughs> oh. Ooh. 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 <laughs> Let's see you spit your way on that you keep one. Keep talking. I could become Teddy Pendergrass, too, motherfucker. Spit, spit your way on that one. Yeah. Yeah, we had said that, too, because Dannon has a, a Facebook thing he does live every day. Yes. Yeah, why do you have your shirt off, bro? Don't ever do that. Oh, wow. Oh, you, Don't you ever show your shoulders. Huh? Yeah, or just see that I had my shirt off the other day because I got out the shower yeah, and I wanted to talk. Don't do that to people that's <laughs> Don't, Don't get mad because you out. can't take your shirt well, why off. Why'd you hit the like button? <laughs> 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 actually, Thank you, TDB. I actually put a heart. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you? Yeah, I meant to ask you about that. Somebody asked me, why does Speedy give you a heart? I'm like, I couldn't tell you. What time is it? What time do you do? I go on usually between 8 and 10. Usually between like 8 o'clock in the morning. To like nine, nine fifty. That's the latest okay. because those are when a lot of people, for some reason, and then the East Coast people be on too. All right, good for you. Mm -hmm. Poetess says you only have like six people, but that's. Uh, I mean, you know, well, they were on the East Coast, but they're gonna grow. 
That's okay. See, that, I was see who's on. See, people think y'all fail to realize because that number doesn't mean who's watching. What number are we talking about? There's a number in the left hand side mm -hmm. when you go live. Oh. But those are the people that can't, like click on and say, you know, they're watching. You can people can watch you without you, Got you. knowing it. Yeah. Got you. So we were thinking we were talking about wow, Dan is gonna going to blow with up. That theory. <laughs> <laughs> I think say people can watch you <laughs> look at without Polis. you knowing. They pulled his hating ass. Look at him just shaking the head. Nah, you ain't right. Yeah. You ain't right. Yeah. Um, so we were saying that Dan and probably was going to blow up and then Lee be the first one to leave the group. No, he's going to literally blow up. <laughs> well, he can always put it out. <laughs> yeah, he do two more commercials. Oh, he's wow. out of here. Nigga. <laughs> So, all right, so we were saying that... Uh, so we just passed the etiquette? marination on the jokes now. What? We just passed it. I'm sorry, was that a funny one? Yes. I, oh, nobody... nobody. ask everybody. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> just can't say it's funny. Okay. Yeah. Who said it? Well, when TDP says it, yes, you're right. Every joke he says, we will pause. Out of fear. <laughs> Shout out to the mummy. <laughs> uh, so, all right, who is, uh, oh, who is Eddie Kendricks? I'll be him. You're Eddie? Yeah. All right, so who so you is... So cocaine problem? Cool. Yeah. <laughs> but isn't Eddie the singer? Yes. Lead they all he, he don't hardly talk. How can he be Eddie? I think more so Melvin. Yeah, he Melvin. I think you're Melvin. Is that the deep voice dude? Yeah, the yeah. deep voice. Yeah, that's Melvin. Right. He was gay. <laughs> He's Melvin. All right, who, who, who's, who's Paul? <laughs> Paul was, yeah. Paul died of cancer early. But he was He's a shorter one. Yeah, Paul. Six six two, two, yeah. He's Paul. And that was a little oh. trivia, uh, TDP, I mean... Uh, Speedy said that every temptation had to be what? 6'4". Six, 6'4". Four. Six, four. Okay. Only one except for Paul was 6'6". Six, six. So six, Dannon two. is Paul. Paul. Paul! Uh, are we going with you being Melvin? I guess. Y'all voted me, man. He <laughs> <laughs> did vote you off the island. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Who's, who's uh, Eddie Kendricks? Yeah, damn. Huh? Yeah, Jeff, Jeff is Eddie Kendrick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, he did free base. <laughs> yeah, it's close. Yeah, yeah he, he did. did. Yeah, he yeah. is from Chicago. Now, Like, for real? Yes. For play, too. Mm. Yeah. Now, like you was old, like yeah yeah so who was who was the other one I know Otis he missed I, them stories I'm Otis yeah yeah and then Speedy's whoever is left who's the uh, other one that would be uh, the nigga with the glasses Ronald David Ruffin David Ruffin, David Ruffin. So you'll be David Ruffin be David. with a slim version uh, double, <laughs> wow. double Ruffin you'll be Ruffin <laughs> you'll be rough old <laughs> you're actor uh, shaming look I'm gonna put something wrong with you're you, acting man. shaming uh, okay uh. so that's the tip let us know if you do know what's the number the number is what uh, Jeff you used to say 323-815-4204 go ahead Jeff one more time 323-815-4204 cool. yeah know. Jeff know uh, it now so See, the cocaine ain't affect my brain that much not yet Hmm. Turn your shit gray. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's working Where towards it. So before we get to the hot news of the day, uh, is, uh, uh, how was your week? I woke up, you know, took my trash out again. That's so right. I'm good. Okay. Dannon? Great week. Uh, three, Four auditions. Got a call back on Monday. Cool. So if I get that commercial, I might be gone next week. No, but. You said um, that about the last one. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I hey, you always got stay. positive things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thinking, no, but uh, it's a uh, great, great week. A uh, lot of stuff. No, it's always positive, man. So far, mm -hmm. yep. Um, now, are you are you nervous okay. or confident when you go into your audition? Nope. I'm. I'm. Oh, I'm, I mean, I'm confident because don't I don't worry about. I don't worry when it comes to commercials, and you know this part. When you you got, to, I worry about the callback. Mm -hmm. I mean, I only worry about the initial audition. I'm sorry. Once I get the callback, then you get nervous. No, I, actually, after the callback, you don't worry about it because it's not up to you after that. After okay. that, it's not even up so to you. So, which one are you nervous about? The Most of the one? initial one. Okay. Because okay. once you get the callback, it comes down to the director and the ad agency. Mm -hmm. So, so you really you have no say. So, the nervousness. What do you do? Well, when I go in there, you know, like I always tell people, a lot of people, if you ever go you into tell? auditions. This first time we asked him. No, other people that ask me about auditioning. Stop. When they he, always when go. When live. <laughs> when they, they'll ask a question. <laughs> <laughs> when I go live. They'll ask a question. They'll say, how do you, how do you slate? Slating is the most important oh, part of it. That, yeah. Okay, now explain to the people what slating please is. Please love Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> <He> said, <"Please> <laughs> so slating, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> is when you get caught, you get an audition, and then they're going to come in, and they're going to ask you your name. First, they're going to say, we'd like to get a picture of you. They're going to take your picture first. So anytime mm. they get ready to take your picture, either smile, half smile, but never look mean. So you don't have to show your teeth all the time. And I took a class on this. Or you can go, mm, or you can show your teeth. Then they're going to come back and say, okay, now we're going to slate. And then they will say your name. Now most people make the mistake and go. Uh, okay, you ready? And this is a mistake they make the first. Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Louis Dix. And then they go to the next one. So I go. They go. So go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Hello, my name is Dan and Green. Are you willing to shave? We, yes, I am. We cool. Th that's <laughs> how, that's how you do it. 
Okay. That's how you slate? Be- yeah, because when you slate like that, what so happens the commercial is... commercial was a shaving commercial. No, 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 no. He no. Said he he just know he's they ask you that on in, in, every yeah, commercial. You have hair on your face. If, anytime someone has hair on their face, they'll ask you, are you willing to shave? Okay. So that's how, you know, and the more you talk, the more you give yourself an opportunity to be to speak, it's better for you. And ever since I've been able to, I started saying, oh, well. yes, hello, my name is Danny Green. It's just a lot better. A lot of people don't do that. Good for you. Uh, yeah. I've been doing it wrong when I audition, when I sleep. You have one audition. You showed up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh, Speedy, how was your week? Uh... Um, my mic, can you hear me? Yeah, I can okay, hear you. Okay, it's automatic. All right, great. My son did very well at the showcase in Phoenix. Yeah. The sophomore showcase. And he has another one this weekend for HBCU at, at Linwood High School tomorrow at 630. And then Saturday, I think in the afternoon. They haven't given the time for Saturday. But he did great. I was, I was re- we had a good road trip. Drove all the way to Phoenix. Now, question. Are you... <laughs> Are you the kind of dad that talks to him while he's doing it? Are you quiet or do you speak to him prior? I used to. I used to. Used to get on his nerves? Or Probably you, so. But, but now I just wait after the game and then I'll just say what he should have did or didn't do. As if you have talent? <laughs> oh, wow. You say that to him like you know? <laughs> Thank you for Ooh, the phone call. early. <laughs> <laughs> Caller. Do you like Danny? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Dang. <laughs> Would you hire Danny? <laughs> He's willing to shave. I'm willing to shave. Hello, who's talking to us? Yeah, this Greenwood out of Tulsa, Oklahoma. What's up? Yo, what's Greenwood? up, Greenwood? Greenwood. Sound like you got man, a cool I can't deal. call it, man. Just enjoying the night, enjoying the evening, man. How you fellas? Good, That's, man. That's well, right. man. Better than I deserve. Exactly. What's going on okay, with you? Gonna, brother, I'm good. I ain't going to hold you guys too long. I've been, I've been listening now for the last past five months. But it was a really good look bringing Speedy on. But I just had a couple quick questions real quick. Shoot. And it's coming at my boy, Dannon, right? Uh-oh. Go ahead. So, so, so Dannon, I got a question for you, man. Yes, sir. How, brother, I love everything you do. Mm. But my question oh. is, how are you going to be on a man show but have women's women jealousy points? <laughs> Like, no Nigga, one did you say <laughs> women like, jealousy points? No, let, 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 let yeah. him explain. So I don't know what he means by it, so let, let him go ahead. I do. Okay, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me go that way. I'm right? doing a limit. So, I've, never seen, I've never seen a Philly dude get offended as much as you do. Ooh, yeah. okay. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. I've, never, I've never seen that. Those dudes are quietly spoken, and when the words they do say, it come from the heart, and they only say it once. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. See that part. Well, that, that, oh, there you go. Oh, what? Yeah. We never got a right. clap before. You know That's I mean? dude. Okay. All right. Yeah. Right. So we upgrading. Yeah, thing, we are. You know, you you tend to, and the other thing is, Dan, and, and I. Well, give me one. That, give me one. Give me one at a time, so I can you know say on that one first, and then we go to the next one. So what is it, sir? Okay. No, no. He said so, he was about to so say something. He said another thing. Go ahead. I, I apologize. So, so, so my last thing, and I apologize, Dan, if it seems like I'm coming off harsh. No, no, not at all. My brother. You come off on your own race yes. way harder than you do, so do on a race that you sleep with, and yep. I think it's just on the and I think it's just on the <laughs> fact, brother. Yeah. Go ahead, and finish. I think it's just on, and I think it's just on the fact, brother, that you don't want to offend the people that sign your paychecks Bam. and the people you lay with. Okay. Oh. All right. Now Greenwood, Great call. Greenwood, right. don't Great hang call. up. Don't hang up. Can right, I address let Dan in address you. Go ahead. All right, let's address okay, go ahead. Go ahead. let's let's address the first part of I guess me being sensitive or whatever. Yeah, yeah being sensitive. Um, I'm only sensitive on one subject matter, and everybody knows that. And so I forgot. So, dear w- mama. <laughs> 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 so, uh, because of that, I'm reminded and now. <laughs> let, y'all want to? Hey, no, no, see that? Y'all want me to address it? No, no, but let that breathe, and then you okay, continue ahead. talking. Okay, I let it breathe. That was funny. So okay. go ahead. So, <laughs> over to my time here, actually, I've gotten a lot better. I'll say that. Most of the, you know, with Lou before Speedy came and, and oh, TDP. Shit. No, no, really. I'm just saying, before the people came, I was a lot more. And I do. You know, I was, that was a situation. I only got sensitive with that part. Me and Polis actually had a conversation about it. I just always told people, you're going to experience that one day. If you haven't, it's a different type of feeling. So, that's where that comes from. If you ever notice, you never hear me talk about, when they talk about my list or... Or anything else. I, you never hear me complain about that. So that's the only thing. So yeah. I'm going to get better with that. I'll take that one. Now, right, cool. let me get with the other part. Um, Your own race. I, my own race. First of all, yeah. you gonna chew gun I, the I, deal, I deal with a lot of black women. A lot, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a joke that's mostly. Racist. Okay. Well, no, I mean, I date 
I, I mean, I, trust me, I do. But Can I somebody wanna, call in. But I want to say this though. Well, now you won't trust. <laughs> I want to say this though. I do get on our race, and because I want to hold us accountable, so I'm not going to sit what? here. You, let, let, oh. let, 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 go, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. I got you. I got you. All right. I'm not going to sit here and not make comments on things that I feel like we are doing that are hurting ourselves. So if people want me to ride with it, I'm not going to ride with it. And a lot of times, or a number of times in the show, I'll look in the chat room or something. People say, Dan, was right about that. Even though a lot of people would say, <laughs> well, you know, I, I can't believe he's going that route. I believe that we should hold each other accountable. And that's why I say what I say with black people. But I have nothing against black people. And it's not about me, somebody who signs my check. That has nothing to do with it. Can I? All right. Okay, go ahead. Real quick. Stay with me, I, uh, Wood. I, I, yeah. I think as a comic, the last thing you should do is... Is the thing went went to mom, which I get, I get it. My dad, my mom gone from this earth. My son gone, and at the end of the day, I'm where they coming. go? Where yeah. they go? No. <laughs> 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 they hey. your daughter. They're go- <laughs> oh, 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 that's too oh, soon. No. Yeah, too soon. Yeah. No, touche, touche. No, I'm saying oh, as a comic, I just think that's the weirdest shit in the world that you could be sensitive about something that we it's a joke and you know we don't mean it personally. Now, no one in this room mm. has ever meant the And if you know something, if you notice what Lewis has said this, Lewis said this a, a couple weeks ago. He said most of the time I'm, it's nothing towards it's anyone not. on the, it's not no, it's not but, I don't feel anything sensitive towards your people. Nor the people that call in. I'm just saying that the one day you that people. the one day a comic. Well, you know, I got, we got well, that. Let him, oh, go ahead, yeah. Greenwood. Go ahead, Greenwood. Yeah, go ahead, Greenwood. Go ahead. Well, well here's the thing, and I had and I, I wanted to address um, Jeff too real quick, but here's my last thing with you, Speedy. I mean, not Speedy, but oh. yes, my 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 black brother. Well. My dad, my dad was in the military for 25 years. Okay, he used to always tell he used to always tell me know your audience. You took a job. And knew the description. You took a job in an audience with a group of men that do shock comedy. If you did not understand your environment, I wouldn't even accept it to the challenge. Because you shouldn't have to compromise your morals to get along and make other people comfortable. Who you uh, are is who you are. If you get offended by someone saying something, you shouldn't even have to say, hey, I'm working on it. I'm getting better to accommodate the people that are around me. Kobe Bryant wasn't a great player because he knew how to play with other players. Kobe Bryant was a great player because other players had to learn how to play with him. There you go. Right. Okay, look, look, one last point on that part. You uh, ain't no Kobe. Uh, yeah. Right, now let me, let me thank Green. Hey, yeah, thank, thank you, you Greenwood. And, and much respect to your dad for yes. 25 years. Well, hold yes. on, he want to say something. What you got to say about me? Oh, yes, yeah, right. Hold off, yeah. Greenwood. Hold off, Greenwood. Hold. Uh, stay with us, and then you'll say something about Jeff so Jeff can feel included. Okay, this is what I want to This is what I want to say. <laughs> You don't take when you become a comedian. It's not like you take a job and you're working with people. And you, my point has always been this: Speedy, Jeff, TDP, Lewis Dix, Poetis, anybody in the world doesn't know my background, so I don't get mad off the fact. You know how many fights I'd have been in off of somebody just saying something about my mom. How many times you got your ass whooped? I don't get my ass whooped many times, bro. It's coming. So, well, <laughs> hopefully it's you. Let's see. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna give you that shot. <clears throat> so, um. So what I'm saying, my man, and I appreciate you calling, is that I'm not going to say I'm, I'm human enough to not say that I don't have any flaws in my entertainment. Flaws. You know, flaws. in my entertainment. Flaws. My, or flaws in my entertainment, you know, <laughs> mentality. That's a, that's a soft spot for me. That's something that I'm working on. I'm at least a man enough to say it. So that's where I leave All it. All right. I, I, I agree with you. So Greenwood, I, I, I applaud you on that. You sound like Jay Cole. No, go ahead. Greenwood, if you could go ahead. Uh, address Jeff that you wanted to say. Hey, can you fix your finger? Jeff. What's up, man? Jeff, my guy. Spider. Jeff, my guy. What up, player? I res- man, I respect your... Uh, um, Gum. Get it out now. Your, your story. <laughs> every, every... You know, my dad used to tell me all the time, every every man ain't a male. Mm. In the Whoa, Yo. shit. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. So when you, when, Jeff, when you jump on and you say, I ain't killed nobody, brother Larry Hoover let it go. Yes. You got to let that gangsterism go, man. You look like a male silverback gorilla with his hat streak back. Oh, wow. Man. Ooh, that today. nigga was waiting for this day. <laughs> that nigga was home brother, practicing. You are, brother, you are a grown-ass man, and you don't have to prove that you hard to nobody. 
He said Duly uh, noted Silverback Thank you Grill Hey Silver. Greenwood I, I, Thank you I, Duly noted Greenwood Thank you so much uh, Thanks got Greenwood th- 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 I'm gonna say Jeff did you wanna respond to that No he's Alright so cause Duly one of the noted. things I, I'm gonna say that Greenwood <laughs> Keep that same energy When I come to Tulsa <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I, I, mean, I own a dispensary I, I welcome you Play, okay, all right, cool. All POTUS right. will be there tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, here's the I'm thing. I'm looking for Greenwood. Okay. Right, let's, wait, wait. wait. No, here's the thing. Greenwood, here's the thing. Before you get off air, POTUS is going to talk okay. to you, and she's going to give you information so you can send her some stuff. Yes. How's that? Uh, and how, and, and, how and donate, donate to the show. show. I want to... Yeah, I want to figure out how, how can I donate to the show. How there you right, go. Stay on the phone. And she'll tell you how to do that. And thank you so much, man. Appreciate you, man. Thank there. you for your words, man. Hey, yeah. no problem, Danny, and I appreciate you taking it like a man. Hey, brother, it's all good. That's what we do for Philly. He yeah. take it like a woman, too. <laughs> right. No, you took it like a woman, he now, said, Jeff. Now, <laughs> interesting thing. The information is on the screen, Greenwood, and thank you for not holding us up. <laughs> <laughs> already, man. I, I, I'm sorry Great call. That no, that's all right. Yeah, Great call. Right. No, good, good, good. Good call. So I, I think he, he was yeah. highlighting some shortcomings, that you know, and everyone has shortcomings. I applaud you for, uh, yeah, I wish you would stop chewing the gum, yeah, that's but I applaud you for, horrible radio. yeah, and Jeff, of course, you take things the way you take it. And uh, okay, and you uh, leave my finger alone. Yeah, it was probably all right. <laughs> um, and uh, so yeah, I, I tore a ligament. Silver hair back. So listen, <laughs> yeah, he hit you. Gorilla back. Yeah, yeah. gorilla back. Don't forget the gorilla part. <laughs> but then again, that's okay because that means he's, he's he watches listen, the show. Watches the show. He's and committed. I appreciate it. Yeah. Okay, so listen. Um, so we know who the temptations are. So now the, well, the I, big. I want to say the same point. What Greenwood said, and in in Dennis defense is. When you're on social media, you see these type of replies and responses, and Danon is only giving you what's out there. It's not his personal thing. It's what people are talking about in society. So we're oh, okay. bringing That's that element to the show. Okay. True. Because like you it. said, but he does the clarification. And right. I didn't Thank appreciate you. somewhat you saying that we don't know you. We care about you. No, no, you I didn't say you guys. No, no, okay. I didn't say I that. know we haven't met the cat. No, speak <laughs> on yourself. I've been the cat next week. No, I'm not saying that, but you said something last week. There you go with the feminine response. <laughs> <laughs> you said something last week. Broken that, wrist. <laughs> you said something last week that Thank you, I Wood. agree with, which is you said. I'm, well, two weeks ago, you said, I don't take it personal from nobody here. And I don't. Right. I don't take it from you guys. Like I you said. No. I took it I personal. Mama to, used to say, <laughs> "I only took it personal because." Yeah, I, I feel like this. Hey, if let you let me say, let me finish. Go ahead. Put it this way: if you told me something bothered you, mm-hmm. no matter you being a comedian or not, Mama don't cry. I wouldn't take. I wouldn't. I wouldn't touch it. Right. I would. That's it. No, I'm just saying what I wouldn't. I'm right. not saying no one's supposed to. I'm right. just saying that's just how I. But am. you know, here in the man's world, we. So you. that's why I've and I've said I've got I've learned to, and gotten better and just said, hey, it is what it is. And it helps don't you, you have get a segment. <laughs> hey, oh, oh. Damn, he called back. This motherfucker. I'm in trouble. Caller. It's Dan and a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Chew on it. Chew on it. Hey. Hey. Who this is? Pat Nikita, well, I bet you. you. Well, hello, caller. How are you? Speak to us. Hey, what's going on, gentlemen? This is McVeigh from you. What up, oh, yo, what's up, McVeigh? Yo. What is his name? McVeigh. McVeigh, what's up, hey, baby McVay, boy? How you doing? My man. Hey, what's going on? Hey, man, I just wanted to call on behalf of myself and tell Danny. Danny, you got to understand something, brother. Uh-huh. We've been listening to Speedy, Lou, TDP, Poe since 08, 09. And so we've been watching these guys have us laugh for all this time. And so when we're making comments or whatnot, brother, none of it is personal. You see TDP throw those uh, one-liners out there. We learn these things from these guys, and we just shoot them back out. Man, we love you on the show, brother. Don't take it personal. And I'll just say this last thing. Knowing that how you was uh, taken in by the family or what have you, and how you was brought up or whatnot, we understand and empathize and sympathize with everything that you got going on. Right, right. On on, on, on the three daddies. And, and so we understand, we understand, and we appreciate you giving your time to the show, man. And hopefully, you all this hay in my room. We, <laughs> we we accept you like we accept these guys, man. These guys have been making us laugh for a lot of years, bro. And we follow them from one show to the next. And you're now part of that family, also, man. Is that a so donkey? please don't take it personal. <laughs> okay, what's your name again? McVeigh. 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 First of all, McVeigh. McVeigh. McVeigh, thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. I do want to say this though. Uh, From the third Speedy world, Speedy Show was is over. He came over to this show here, oh. so uh, 
He joined hey, this no, week. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. I hey, joke with Little. Come on, McVeigh. Come on, McVeigh. Go ahead. Go ahead. Real quick. Wherever, wherever Speedy, Lou, McVeigh, Poetis, and a name that I probably shouldn't mention, but that other individual on his uh, platform, we're going to follow them wherever they go. We're going to watch them wherever they go. Right. We are true fans of these brothers. And so no matter what platform, no matter what shut down, when we find out that Speedy is somewhere else, you can see in the chat room, we coming. Yes. All right, now wait, what's the name Mom. you didn't want to mention? We don't mention? give a fuck yeah, who what? mama yeah. got. <laughs> <laughs> or who daddy was Men- there. She forgot my I name. I fuck. I don't want to be disrespectful to poetry, so, you know, we, you know I, I won't that. mention that or whatnot. All we right. love you, Paul. Well, okay. We don't mind you being disrespectful. I'm gonna pull a, a Dan yeah. in. I'm gonna pull a Dan in to get sensitive about that. <laughs> okay. All right. Fair enough. Appreciate it. So, Danny, did you want to respond? Yeah, to I responded. Hey, y'all boys, I, have a good night. Thank All right, you, you too. Thank you, man. Okay. Okay. One, I appreciate appreciate him. You know, yeah, we got that. speaking so, that. To your point. Yeah. yeah. Wow. <laughs> I gotta say, yeah. <laughs> but I do want I do want the audience to know that uh, I have known these guys for over twenty something years. So it's not like I don't know. Um, I don't know TDP. Ain't that some shit? (laughs) Go ahead, go ahead. That's funny, TDP. Go ahead. So I don't want the audience to think that I'm just somebody that just popped up and don't know you guys. Yeah, yeah, we wouldn't have you here. No, 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 no. Not. I know you guys. No, 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 no. no, no, I'm talking about the audience because the audience. I think the audience is seem assuming. Yo, this guy just popped up and now I've I've known these guys and we've talked. Uh, many a times. And we tried to get Kente Scott to fall in. He tried to. <laughs> no, I think he meant so more so that we know that you've known everybody for a long time. But he's talking specifically <laughs> about our brand of comedy. Ralph Trez Van Ass. The Foxhole Days. Yeah. So, oh, man, he couldn't survive. Oh no! Yeah. On the real, no. no let me tell you something. Have, I totally. No, hold on. No, I'm not, no, no, I'm, I'm not saying. I'm I saying, agree. No, I did y'all we, show one time. And I, I said, I ain't going back upstairs again. And I never yeah, did. I, I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> <laughs> so, y'all not, you know, but this, that, that was, was years ago. Show. Now, yeah. now, the foxhole did help me work through everything I had to work through. It was. It no, was I think Luke, it was the cocaine. No, it was. No, wow. That was done long cocaine? before that. But no, it was a beautiful thing. <laughs> Who is this? These crackheads I'm around. You did cocaine, Louis? <laughs> no, no, he's true. It was me, Lynn <laughs> Bias. <laughs> it was one oh, time. Hey, shit. Was one time. Lil' me, you know Lynn Bias. Hold up. You stupid. Uh, <laughs> 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 people in Boston, hot as fuck. Uh, now, listen, no, all people all right. in Maryland is. All right, there too. I'm Louis Dix. Speed Doggy Dog. Teeter. Jeff Arnold. Dan Green. What's the name of the show? In a man's world, tighten up your belt. So listen, we appreciate all of you listening, but Absolutely. I do. I know we've been going back and forth, and we haven't talked about it. A dear person has passed. Who, Mr. C? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. Mr. C passed. Oh, okay. Oh, who's Mr. C? Mr. C. DJ yeah. Big Daddy Kane, oh. first DJ. Oh, yeah. I think you did that again. And we know we yeah. lost Louis Gossett Jr. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When? yeah, yeah. When? Rest- Louis Gossett Jr. died last week. I didn't even know. He died yeah. in his sleep. This is why y'all can't listen to <laughs> all of oh, was, te- was, Speedy's takes. He, was he don't even know Speedy. what's going on. He was holding Speedy's mom's hand. <laughs> oh. <laughs> all right. Oh. Oh. Okay. Let me, hold on. Let me do my dad in that face. <laughs> all right. Yeah, that was, that, that uh, yeah, 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 wow. that, yeah. All right. All right. So uh, listen up. So, and of course, visual. today there was an announcement. That we lost uh, an icon. Icon. Well, uh, well I mean, no, he was an icon. He's infamous. He's, I mean, he was, I was a fan when he was running in that blue and red and, and number 32. Yes, sir. Um, I wanted to block for him because I was a center in football. Oh, I wow. mean, hold on. Um, hold yeah, on. Hold on. <laughs> you mean dudes was putting their hands between your little eyes? <laughs> Yeah, I was a center. I Rubbing was on his balls. Yeah, was you a was a center, Louis? <laughs> and I was you, a long this snapper. Is what, you, what, what do you want to play? That nigga no. shaved for home game. <laughs> <laughs> Blue, damn! <Yeah. laughs> Put no, your hand under there. I, when I first, really? in, in high school, I was a center. And then when I got to college, I thought I was going to be a DB. Oh, and man. then they timed me on the 40, and it was a 5-5. Five, five, and so you go over there with the line. <laughs> and so, well, you bigger than and I, Yeah, I, I bulked. I was like 225. Were well, you on the 40 in sandals? <laughs> <laughs> flip, 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 flip. So, but I found my calling because I, I enjoy, it was playing center because I was in oh, control wow. of the uh, the line and I was found a long snapper. Calling. And I actually truly thought I had a shot at getting to the NFL as a long snapper. Oh, you know, well. snapping on punts and, and then, you know. And how'd that work out? It, it, you see here with I us. Am. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't sitting. So, uh, but that dream got me to where I am. No, don't because tell you, have, you have one dream in life and then you just continue dreaming. Right. And then you find it and you hopefully you get some You woke up hits. from that real fast. Uh, no, yeah. I didn't. I, 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 it was beautiful. Which, col- which colors? 
Yeah. Sonoma State. Sonoma State. Yeah. So Cossack. But now did they did Sonoma they uh, uh, recruit you? Seawolf. Or did you did they recruit you? Yeah, actually, I was on the chess team, and I was in the, they were just starting. So you were really there to play chess and say, yeah, "Oh, I like they, football too." But they were starting their football program. I okay, this guy, rich guy, had started his football. Program. Who's your Who's your Hall of Famer that came out of there? Oh, Allen. Okay, yeah. tell everybody else. Eric yeah, Allen, man, Mr. Allen. Yeah. So it was a d- offensive tackle. So One listen, of the best. So um, OJ Simpson, <sighs> Juice Ornthal. What's his other name? James Simpson. What uh, happened? <laughs> he, now, now, hey, uh, much respect, peace to the heart of his family because yes. we know they love him. No, he seriously. died of what prostate happened? cancer. Oh, he died. Dang. Like he knew he had it, even though he had made that announcement. He said, no, I'm "At good. Super Bowl, yeah. yeah, I'm good. Hospice. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be hospice. here for a minute. <laughs> no, he ain't. Man. Talking about hospice. I got and, a Super Bowl party coming. Up. <laughs> and it was just the news when I saw him trending at the top. I was like. It must be gone. Yeah, yeah. I didn't believe it at first, so I had to go look because it was on. Really, you didn't believe it was no nah, because people be putting false information up on social media. Someone mm-hmm. said OJ died. I'm like, nah, let me go so ahead and keep. What it. particular? Do you look at all of them or? I, I go to Google and then I go to uh, ESPN. What did so, you see it on first though? Or it was just a, somebody had made oh, up okay. like a poster, look like they made up a, a fake poster, just saying OJ died. Breaking now, news. What's your go to in the morning for news? Where do you go first? Do you go to your phone? Do you go to CNN? Do you go to MSG? Do you go five? I go to I go to YouTube. So you go what to YouTube. The fuck? Yeah, because you, you can hit the news. You can go directly to I go main news clips. Where do you go? MSNBC. And where do you go? I go to God. <laughs> so God told you OJ passed? <laughs> he cut himself up. <laughs> <laughs> TP, where do you go? I go to Al Jazeera English. Now, I listen to NPR. Um so I'll turn that on. So yeah, so he had died. What was your reaction when you heard he died? Uh, white people gonna have a national holiday. So I mean, what can you think? It's like hey, okay. I mean, they're making a big thing of it, but I mean, you know, he, the juice he did. Okay, you. I can I sell the gloves on eBay now. <laughs> I felt bad for him. Why? No kidding. <laughs> I mean, that's well that's, because. Captain Obvious. <laughs> Over the last number of years, even though his situation happened years ago, a lot of black men have not, we've all, something has happened to us where at the end we've been either degraded or we've lost our statue. You know what I'm saying? So, what in do you OG, mean? Like, well, you, you know, you look at Cosby, you know, being broken down, R. Kelly being in jail, stature. you know. Yeah. So, in terms of OJ, here's a guy that was celebrated by, this, by our country for years. And a case came up that we still don't know if he did it. And his life has never been the same to okay. the point where he got, I believe he got set up in Vegas. Right, I'm oh, going to yeah. come Definitely. back Definitely. Yeah. to see Definitely. if you think he did it. But Speedy, what was your thoughts when you first heard I was sad. It? I was sad. You sad? Yeah. Anybody pass away, you sad for that and their family. Mm. And then when they played the thing about him, I'm not in hospice. Then you, two months later, you're gone. Mm-hmm. Uh, just sad. And yeah. TDP? Uh, first of all, he was the greatest celebrity in Los Angeles in the 70s. He started doing business, and he's not black, he's OJ. So he's always been that he's dude. Black, and then to um, see him run on Monday Night Football with the Buffalo Bills and 2,000 yeah. yards in the, I think it was a 14 the 14 game season. 14 yeah. Yeah. He had. Yeah. yeah, he was he was that guy. Yeah. yeah. You know? He now, thank you. Did he do it? Of course he did. Nah. Who, at this point, who cares? Just answer the question. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. You, yes do no. you feel he did? He committed that crime? No. Do you? Feel he didn't he... do it. Cause black people don't kill like that. How do they kill? No, <laughs> <laughs> that was maybe I may not be snitching right now. <laughs> yeah. No, but we. Well. I mean, I just don't see us coming up and cutting throats. Cause we good, good, right? No, <laughs> it's hilarious. hilarious. <laughs> I'll, I'll let it sit. Call back here. from last yeah. week. Um, I just don't believe he was was going to be standing there and, and stab, cut them both up like that. I, now, if you shot him, if someone got shot, I'd have been like, yeah, the nigga did it. Okay, but no, I don't think he did. TDP. it. I don't think. Oh, I mean, Speedy. I don't sorry. think he did. You don't think mm-hmm. TDP? Once the judge sealed the AT and T phone record for <laughs> seventy five years, that showed that her Nicole called her mother at a certain time where they said the murders were taking place. I don't think he did. So now let's expand on that. You said, real quick, you said um, that 
the phone records were sealed for 75 years. Why, what is that? Help us ex- explain that to us. What, what was sealed? At the time when they was talking to the mom, she said she talked to her daughter around a certain time that they said that the murders happened mm-hmm. on a phone call. Where they assumed so when Johnny Cocker was trying to get those records and everything, they sealed them for 75 years. Okay. So, so you still can't see it. And I told you my theory, which a lot of people may or may not know, Ron Goldman was gay. And so that takes out all that you say, oh, well, he was mad. He couldn't have been mad because he knew Ron was gay. Now, did you have you dated Ron? Yeah, exactly. Did you date Ron at that time? How do you know he was gay? <laughs> but no, to Smitty's point, when OJ saw her blowing the dude on the couch, if he that's, don't kill her then. Yeah, yeah that's what the killing would have started. Got you. At you know? least for a black man. Got you. So now, who said Ron was gay? How did that come out? Speedy. <laughs> it came out he he just, hey, and he was a black belt. So the fact that he got. Cook like that. Well, he left his bill home that night. You sure? oh. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot my bill. Hey, I don't know what to do. It's my gig. <laughs> now, as this soon, is real life. <laughs> as, as soon as I heard the information, the first person I died? thought to call, yeah, he died, right. was to call this fool because oh, I know he says things that just like, mm-hmm. and it was either him or him, mm-hmm. but he doesn't answer his phone before 8 no. a.m. So you, you're not calling him. It's bougie, man. Well, he yeah. takes my calls. Huh? He takes well, he my... does not take mine until oh, after 10.30. I don't know what that's about. <laughs> you called me before 10 this morning? Yeah, because of the circumstances. <laughs> no, you, you still, and I still answer, bro. That's true. Louis, you know it's a little piece of hair right here? Oh, wow. <laughs> Thank God. It's it waved. It's a, hey, nigga. I thought he was Jewish. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so. No, hold on. <laughs> Jewish. Because his hair keeps going with that. You got to put the yarmulke on. There's a little gust of wind that come this way and then move. That's oh shit. That's uh, something there. Yeah, yeah. You want me to cut the top? No, no, no. Leave that alone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Leave that alone. I, I, I am feeling. Gloria missed that spot. <laughs> she got Gloria. the mustache. Gloria, yeah. hey, he jokes about Gloria, but he tried to date her. Oh, what happened? Uh, she was, she was she crazy. Cut. <laughs> yes, <laughs> <laughs> she ain't cut my hair right. <laughs> um, so hysterical. Uh, uh, you made me mess up my thought. Whoa. You called me. Sick okay, I called you, and yeah. you said <laughs> so. I was thinking sick jokes because he always these two come up with sick jokes. Um, so right away. I said, because I always try to top him mm-hmm. before he gets. So I said, who's going to be the pallbearer? <laughs> <laughs> What'd you say? Well, it was, I'll, I don't even remember what I'll just say. Al Collins. Al yeah, Collins. By himself. Yeah. 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 My muse said that he's in the Bronco teammate. truck. In the Bronco truck. <laughs> Hilarious. Him in the Bronco truck. So, what was your first comedic joke that you, like, all right. I can't remember. It was so long. No, ago. no, no. Not about OJ, but when you heard it. Because we as comics think right away oh, of no, something. I, I, didn't, I didn't have a joke. It's yeah. weird. I didn't. No. 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 TDP? Somebody died, man. Okay. Just him going ahead and saying, you know, cut me some slack. <laughs> <laughs> You said going to heaven on Judgment Day. Hey, God, come on. <laughs> I, yeah, because we were saying who's going to be waiting for him. Yeah. You know. No, it's the debate between God and the devil. They argue it now. <laughs> yeah. <that's laughs> the devil was like, we don't want him down here. <laughs> <laughs> Kill my people. <laughs> um, so, yeah, and I, I, I wanted to call Chris Spencer because I know he's quick and funny in that mm-hmm. way. So yeah. do you think the comedians now are going to refurbish all of their old OJ jokes? Yes, yes. Definitely. I hope not. Yeah, two point oh. Yes. Yeah. Now, yeah. Did, did you have an OJ bits? When no. You were, no. Did no. What you? happened now? Yeah, I had a bit. What was one of your I, I, OJ I, bits? I, it's too long to get. No, no. Just, just say. I, I pretty mean, much my my bit was about. It's not like I, a dog bit, is it? What funny? Yeah, I'm saying. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, <laughs> that was good. I like that. I like that. Um, no, I, 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 like Speedy said earlier. He said he tried to go a different angle, and my angle was, you know, Al Collins really was a friend. Mm-hmm. I said because you know I wouldn't have been driving around town like that all day. Minute the cop can look, nigga, they got you. I'd have just pulled all over and and then I have a little bit about that. I said, but then when he went to Vegas, you know, and Al said, look, man, we got to go to Vegas, and I had a whole whole Vegas bit too. So, you know, we all I think like TD, we all said people are going to bring it back, oh, but okay. I think it's got to be brought back differently. That's this is going to you're going to be able to tell who can write and who can't. Okay, because if people go back and do something that they're like hold it, oh, this is 1995. You right. know, you you didn't you didn't even curve night. it. You know what I mean? Right. Yeah. So you're it's gonna like, see. It's like doing a phone bit, but still using the word rotary dial. Right. 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 You like, yeah. 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 Like, you know, so so you you you'll be able to look at comments and be like, okay, you you was at the crib waiting for something to happen, yeah. waiting for him to die. Like, oh, yeah. Hey, could you cut those cards? Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, Go ahead. 
Did you have a, a OJ? You said you went the other way. Yeah, I can't remember the joke. That was a mm. very long time ago. Mm. Okay. Uh, I'm, sh- I'm sure if your set's going rough, you, you'll bring it back up. <laughs> hey, OJ. <laughs> no, Lewis, yeah. I've never had a rough set. Oh. Never. Uh, now, you know. Now, now I'm, I'm just going to be completely honest. I've had sets that I wasn't, like, I was like, ah, I wasn't feeling that. But I ain't never had a set where somebody went, ooh. Now, I'm going to. I've had one I, like that. I, I, yeah. You've had a few. <laughs> 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 You I'll had be, a couple of them, first. Jeff. I'll, I'll, still, no, no, you no, combined no. them all together. <laughs> yeah. Now I have to say, you, you've gotten a lot yeah, stronger. I've always been strong. No, you haven't yeah. always been strong. Yeah. But, but you, I must say, and if I'm going to be totally honest, you, you're right. You've always been truly funny and yeah, on point. Yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah. You, you, you. I, I, I will never. Whenever I watch you, I never walk and go get something to eat. Yeah, I, I've I had a set because he's always eating it. I've had a set. I've had a set that well, I got off stage. I was like, ah, just wasn't feeling that. And that was recently I did it. I probably shouldn't have did the show. And it was there was like five people in the fucking audience and they really wasn't paying attention. And I probably should turn that one down. But fucking uh, Franz Cassis called me otherwise. But oh. that just taught me I got to stop one of those doing shows. He don't like Franz. <laughs> no, I, no, stop I think, that. I think All as right, comics, yeah. at, 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 at where we are now, we have to turn down some shows. It's sometimes you got to go, I'm not doing that. Well, yeah. I'm not at that. I, I, no? I need to turn down shows. You call me, I'm going to do for the three people. I, I just want to get better. Yeah. Um, TDP? Absolutely. <laughs> Did you, uh, Absolutely. Okay, thank so you. So many. <laughs> so many the name. Uh, I think Lou, you funny as fuck. Especially the new Lou, the angry Lou, funny as fuck. New Lou? I'm getting there. I'm getting better. I'm a lot stronger. I, I, it's interesting. Where's I had the a, Portis uh, report? Come on. <laughs> Jeez, you're killing me. Oh, yeah. There's love in the room. Yeah. yeah I love your uh, outfit there. Uh, listen, OJ died. You niggas get soft. <laughs> I saw you at Chuckles. <laughs> the fuck? Uh, OJ yeah. is. You're supposed OJ. to be going at that motherfucker. That, you know that old lady that said, run OJ, run OJ. She's right there. <laughs> She's right. Okay. So. Uh, <laughs> So you think he with Bob Shapiro right now? <laughs> oh. I know Robert Kardashian is giving him the loot of the time. Yeah, Robert back. Kardashian, that's what I mean. Now you yeah. think Johnny Cochran's in heaven? Yeah. yeah. yeah Nick, you owe me for that case. Exactly. <laughs> Johnny's up there. All right, what the Johnny Car- go get him in. We Kardashian, <laughs> he in heaven. He upstairs or downstairs? He upstairs. He upstairs. He gonna hand OJ the bag. Like, take your shit, nigga. Co- Nicole and Ron? What they gonna Lewis, you gotta understand, Lewis, we are down here. They're, everybody else yeah. is up there. We're down here. Yeah. Okay, there's, there's no down there. There's no hell. We're in it. Yeah, mm-hmm. up there. We're in it. Once oh, we leave profound. this body, we'll get out of it. That's profound. That's uh, sure. Danny wouldn't have said that. No, I sure <laughs> wouldn't have. <laughs> I sure <laughs> wouldn't have said that. Well, listen, peace to the heart of his family. Yeah, now, absolutely. Now, his exactly. sis, now, we were saying earlier that we think, you say they didn't do it, that, who, that Jason might have done it. I've heard some people tell me that they feel that Jason. He was the culinary the school, son. and Johnny Cochran fought to keep his name out the trial as well. Sure did. Yeah. yeah. He, didn't, he wasn't mentioned nowhere in that trial. You didn't even know O.J. had a son. So you think O.J. took the fall for his son? Absolutely. Absolutely. Because he had just bought him a slice of Maddie. <laughs> <laughs> now, his daughter, what's her name? Arnell. Arnell, she, yes. She went through a few people. A few people went through her. She was cute. She was sexy. She used to hang out when we was going to the Hollywood Athletic Club. She used to yeah. hang out with She used us. to be there, yep. Oh, Hollywood Athletic Club. Tuesday yeah. night. Man, that was... That was, that was oh, that, that's, that where I, was, that's where I met you. I met oh, someone wow. else there. Wow. I met that's where I met you? Are you yeah. single? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> I, met, I met Beyonce there. Ooh. Mm. That's where so I met Beyonce. Bought her, no. met you. bought her a no. Corona. No, what I'm saying about Lou is that's where... Because you were doing it with um, the late the promoter. What was his name? Roland, Roland, Roland Woodward and Reggie. Yeah. And Reggie liked oh, me. Mm. And Roland was tough. Mm-hmm. And when you were doing it, I, I asked for time. And it was like, no, we, we got this guy. And he came up. And you introduced yourself. And you was like, oh, shit. And I said, oh, he from Philly. So then I met you there. And then you used to be the host of it. And then I think a couple times you couldn't do it. And I had, and I had kept coming. And then Roland didn't want to give me the shot. And Reggie gave me the shot. Oh. And then I did good that night, and Reggie said, hmm. "Okay, yeah." Yeah, yeah. And Roland, then, Roland, we all, Roland was tough. Roland was a good guy. He was a good guy. Yeah. And I met I met Beyonce. Good guy. There. And she was oof. upstairs. The, that was a good spot, man. Uh, what Beyonce was the funniest? What was the up. funniest OJ joke you ever heard? Mm. Mm. That's a good, it's it's a good, good question. Think back. Paul Mooney. What did Paul say? Paul Mooney. Paul Mooney. Saying his son come up to OJ said, "Dad, can I can I drive the car?" 
He said, go ax your mother. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Paul Mooney. Now, uh, so um, I asked Code 3 how the atmosphere was in the precinct. Yeah, I was that. Yeah. And she said, Which one was she at at the time? Well, she's in the uh, downtown okay. in the, uh, DA's office. 900? Yeah, wherever. By Temple? Yeah, yeah nine hundred at that time because that's a long time no, ago. No, no, that's where she is now. now. Okay, yeah, yeah, but so I'm saying yeah. I was asking how the temperature was there, and Got she it. was saying yeah. that um, the ones who are keep on their side and the other ones keep on their side. Mm -hmm. oh. You mean black now, white? Yeah. Okay. Was she on the force when that happened? Yeah, that was how long ago? Ninety five. Ninety five. Ninety five. No, I think she was just in in the academy okay. but she worked in the prison first she was no. a sheriff first. Yep, you gotta be a, yeah. Yeah. Well, she, she was a sheriff first well, well, not the butt not the prison <laughs> at the jail yes she was the jail thank you she's in the tent twin towers 25% of the couple in this country the remix Hi, Paul. It is. Hi, everyone. Hey, what's up, hey, what's up? Like hey, P money. All right, I don't think OJ did it either, go. and I don't think his son did it. Um, did you do it? I didn't do it either. Okay. <laughs> she said um, that. <laughs> a lot I've been hearing for the over the years is that she was caught up in drugs, yeah, and, and that it could have been some, uh, you know, some cartel cartels. Shit. Um, Especially when you find out how she died. Yep, and then some witnesses said that they saw when the first happened and they had this lady on the news, she was saying how she saw four people running from that area wearing all black. Yeah. And they totally ignored that. But I just don't think OJ was physically capable of doing it. I agree with that. And getting um, away with could, it completely. Could, and then... To cut somebody's neck, two people, and they only found specks of blood on you, like... And you go to the airport? Because you remember he, he traveled that night. Yeah, he went to the airport, but what about the Bronco? Mm -hmm. OxyClean. No, no, because remember he went in the limousine. That's it. That's where they said they found No, I'm the saying he got in. If he did it, he went. He was in the Bronco, right, at some point when he was leaving the scene. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because it was parked crookedly in the street. That's how they noticed it. I, now... He might have been there. He might have went to the scene mm -hmm. at yeah. some point, but I don't think he did it. Yeah. And so it's interesting because 84 uh, percent. Well, this study, this poll was done in 2016. 84 percent of white people believe that he did it. And 53 percent of black people. Well, excuse yeah, me. Right. black now, people. Now, think now, he you know, what, you know, what was interesting, though, when it happened, when the trial was happening. Every, like when he was trying to get away before the trial and all that, everybody was with OJ. Like even the whites and the blacks, everybody was like, go. Mean? Like they were like, nobody was saying he did it. They were oh, like, okay. everybody in LA seemed like they were like, he didn't do it. But it was midway through the trial when all of a sudden it seemed like there was a division. Evidence, the evidence division with, to the yeah, with yeah, everybody. So what, what really messed him up was that at the crime scene, they did not take care um, or precaution in the crime scene. Everybody was walking in over it. Picking up shit. There's footprints, more footprints from LAPD oh, than... No, a necklace. <laughs> <laughs> just fell right off. <laughs> uh, so they... they. It's interesting that, like you said, that the whole... Somebody he got off right the, here. He got off the plane. I mean, he went on the plane and yeah, no I mean, blood. He flew the, yeah. But that one bag that they had, the one suitcase. Who had that suitcase? Robert Kardashian. Robert Kardashian. Yes. The was Louis bag. Yeah, that, he yeah, that was interesting. It. Okay, so do you think... They still never got that. Yeah. So mm -hmm. what do you think happened to that bag? It's an ocean. He died with it. And you think OJ so he never gave it back to him? Well, he's going to give it to him now. They had some <laughs> documentary. I forget which one it was, but it showed when OJ came back and how Robert Kardashian grabbed his bag. No, what happened was Kim was in the car with her dad when he pulled up and the police let him go in. And then about 45 minutes later, he walked out with the Louis Vuitton bag and he opened up the trunk and he put it in and then they drove away. So even Kim, when she was That's asked she about said. it, she was like, I don't know what was in the bag. So and, Well, Kim was a child. She yeah, she was like 14, but, his, but Robert never discussed and it was never brought up again. Uh -huh. 
I think the turning him. point in the trial was the uh, um, the detective. Mark Furman. Mark Furman. That was the turning point. Because when he lied, when he lied that you ever used the N-word and then he pleaded the fifth. And then everything's that, off the books. Eh? Everything started switching because they couldn't get a good interview out of him. He oh, was, yeah, do it. Say, he, yeah, I call black yeah, people he, niggas. Yeah, he was the head I dude. I kill a nigga. That's, yeah. that's what I Yeah, said. when he said that, everybody's like, no, you said it. Yeah, you got it. You got it. You got but it, but it, it changed the narrative. Yeah. Yeah. Wasn't he carrying around, too? I don't, I'm don't. i not sure if this is fact, that he was carrying around a vial of blood. OJ's that's blood. What they no, that yeah, was the other guy. Um, not not Furman. That was the other guy that was doing the investigating. Yeah. Tom, yeah. Oh, yeah. Tom, yeah. What was his name? I forgot his name. But he's a detective, yeah. Mm-hmm. But then but, it really fucked up where Marsha Clark and Chris Darden started fucking. Yeah. So that's really fucked it up, too, so. Mm-hmm. No pun intended. Well, yeah, enough of Chris. <laughs> Chris enjoyed himself. Yeah. That glove, what that Johnny Forever line was. Yeah. But it, it was they a don't fit. Don't fit. Was, but the hat on, too. Yeah, I mean, OJ, you're right. He had the Go ahead. He had it because that Friday, that's when F. Lee Bailey was questioning Mark Farmer, and he said, "Do you ever use the word nigga?" And it was on a Friday. So, "Do you ever use the word nigga?" Okay, that was it. So it was like a soap opera. Like we got to wait till Monday to see what's gonna happen. <laughs> and all you had to do is say, "Yeah, I called somebody." And he nigga. had the whole weekend to Look, do that. I ain't kill no niggas. <laughs> yeah, the whole weekend. I ain't kill them niggas. <laughs> <laughs> that's all you had to say. That nigga I, killed. But him. once he, but once he, once that happened, it was a wrap. Yeah, because the focus started going on his background. Yeah, that he's racist and he set it all up. Exactly, and. I hate, you know, like today when you heard Stephen A. Smith talk, I was just, I'm really to to disappointed in some of the comments that some people are making about O.J. Look, who, we none of us was there. We, we can only go by what the court says. He was let off. Not let off, but he was found innocent. Yeah, that's all that counts. There it is. Well, I'm glad I wasn't there. <laughs> but the telling point is when, uh, was it Dershowitz was the head judge at, or the head um, legal at the time? Yeah. He's trying to tell OJ, you know, we should take a deal. Up. He said, well, get your ass out of here. Man, get Johnny on the goddamn no So he was, he was on the team, but he wasn't for Right. Right. Boss lady. Yes. Go ahead. We're ready. So here's a clip from um, one of my favorite Paul Mooney clips um, about OJ. And what they say, OJ ain't did that. Yeah. That boy ain't did that. Just want to blame a nigga. <laughs> that boy has got bad knees now. The young OJ, but that boy got bad knees. And when you see him running through the airport, that's a double. That boy got bad knees. He had to be the quickest nigga I know that can kill two people and then still catch the red eye. That nigga's quick. <laughs> you ever been to the airport? Just putting your luggage in, getting through the little gate and shit takes you 20 minutes. Boy ain't did that. It's a damn shame. That is hilarious. Shout out to Paul Funny Mooney. Shout out to Paul Mooney. He's one of the few comics I'd pay to see at any time. Funny yes. Dude. You wouldn't get paid to see Danny? Yeah, I, I wouldn't pay. <laughs> 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 Danny, you cool. That's I, would, I would pay to go see That's Danny. That's an interesting question, though. What? Would you pay to see Danny? Yeah, as long as I get half price. <laughs> 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 I'm paying half price. I'll pay that $5. Yeah, you would you, you got... pay to see Lewis? No. I wouldn't pay to see none of y'all. Because I know y'all. <laughs> I pay, pay to go see some comics I know. Are any of you guys um, participating with the Netflix? Nah, got we, no, thing? I got stabbed uh, back again. Yeah, I, only think, I think I might be involved with the Salute to Sinbad. They're having a fundraiser for him. And they're having a um, a Salute to the Comedy Union? Yeah, I, yeah, I heard about that. that. Enns hasn't called us. Yeah. Mm. He don't like so, me. Well, you know, Dude, I already know he would. Enns don't like call. me because I don't like him. Yeah, I'm shooting my special. So. <laughs> I didn't get no call. He don't one, like me because I don't like him. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> why don't you like? Yeah, why don't you like him? Like like no, why doesn't he I, like I, you? I always yeah. thought. Uh, well, I don't know. I, I'm not here. But as far as ends, I always thought ends catered to the white audiences coming in, and then he would do the thing if so. Oh, speed. Why you didn't call me, man? So you can get on the show, right? And I said, well, I just want to come down, hang out. Can I go up? Ah, speed. Got to call me. Let me know. So I call him. Let him know I'm coming. I get down there. And some niggas showed up, and he put them all in front of me. Yeah, and I cussed him out and left. I said, "Nigga, you tell me to call you. I get, I do that, and I get down there. And you bump me for all these non-funny motherfuckers. I man, I got the fuck out of there. Fuck mm. Well, he catered to the white folks. He always catered. Mm. To Did you yeah. perform at the comedy? Yeah, I was one of the main hosts for a long time. Okay, I was. He treated me. I mean, I never had a problem with. I mean, it was hard to deal with because he was very temperamental. You know what I'm saying? But he always would say, "Hey, you know, his whole thing was if you can put people in here." 
promote the, p- promote tonight, huh? he'll give it to you. <laughs> you know. <laughs> propeller. <laughs> propeller. <laughs> promote, <laughs> promote the night, he will give it to you. So I, I, I performed there a whole bunch of times. Okay, we're in the yeah, quarter. Yeah, he was good with you too. I worked yeah. Kevin cooked, Hayes so. said, never sit in the first three rows of a dance <laughs> show. Because <laughs> he'll pop up a punch. See, first of all, thanks, Kev, but actually I have a joke. That I that's see that's one of it. I it used to be, be what happened was I had a show one time. Oh my God. I had a show one time, <laughs> and Don't I wasn't you having have a segment. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that, oh, that, oh, no, 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 no. That's not my segment. Go ahead. Stab us with. I mean, we we bring up stuff and then we. But no, I, go ahead, no go I don't want to be ahead. sensitive. So go I'm ahead, good. Go ahead, go ahead. Me I'm up. saying so. To what he said. Go ahead, Manger. I I made up a joke. Is this gonna be about that? Because. To get people off me for that, so I started making a joke about my spitting list. spitting on people. Right. Yes, so and then what's it, the joke? Let's hear. It. Well, I would tell everybody, hey, I want you know, I want to tell you people hey, right now. Cover. Bitch, you is ugly. <laughs> <laughs> That's a little early. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, it's a little early. So you would tell the people, and I'll just say, hey, y'all, you know, before we get started, cover your drinks, you know, because I spit when I talk, when I get excited, <laughs> and then I have a joke about how so we it was a, talk about that how joke. it was a black thing, mm-hmm. and compared to white people, white people, you know, when their kids have problems. You know, they make sure they go to the doctor. They do anything to get rid of it. We, it's family, in, it's family entertainment for us. Thanks, and then I family. talk about how I want family to calm me down <laughs> and make me do that. Okay. So why don't you call you down to do what? Thanks why don't you for do calling. Whole set? <laughs> Spit on the Excuse table. <laughs> Thanks for calling, Danny. Thanks. Okay. Go ahead. My next story. Um, did anybody catch any of the um, footage or see the eclipse at all? I did. I did. I had on glasses. I had glasses. Because I was at the school. So it was a what big are thing kids? at the school. What are y'all, kids? It was get, a big thing at the yeah. school. All the kids were out and the teachers. And, did anybody hey, go coach, blind? Hey, coach, you wanted to look at it, huh? Did anybody go blind? No, you couldn't go blind couldn't here blind. in L.A. because it wasn't. It was too far away. It was yeah. too far away. I oh, did. So you were already blind. You saw two of them. My coffee, sh- my coffee shop gave out free glasses. Priscilla. Your coffee, you own a coffee shop? Well, the one I go to. Okay. Then. Talk yeah. about it in this segment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, yeah, Danny. Shit. All this loose talk. <laughs> <laughs> there was an incident that happened here in L.A. where a um, self-proclaimed uh, ast- uh, astrologer. Your story. You get it out. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah influencer. She got a new tongue. I'm glad it ain't yours, though. Ooh. Oh. And, um, that was a good one. Fired. Shots fired. That so, was good. Post. A self Proclaimed astrology influencer. And there's no such thing. Is dead after allegedly killing her partner hmm? and eight month old child in yeah. Los Angeles. And then herself. And then, yeah, I started with yeah, she's she dead. <laughs> no, but she killed herself, though. You yeah. didn't say that. Part. No, she said, you see, that's no, she said uh, she's I dead. Can I finish my story? Oh. God damn. <laughs> Let me get to the part where she killed herself. No, no, that ain't right. No, no. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That ain't what he said. <laughs> You said he was in the manger. Yeah. Me? So anyway, this influencer on social media prior to this uh, the eclipse, she was um, uh, posting all these things on Twitter about getting right, and the eclipse um, represents like the, um, end of the world or something. The epitome of spiritual war. Get on the right side. Yeah, she was saying, there. "Where y'all niggas going? 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 You're going to smoke." <laughs> smoke so break. anyway. Um, so she was also, I, I actually scrolled down her Twitter feed. She was somewhat of a conspiracy um, theorist. Did she say why she killed herself? And the, They didn't say why, but what happened was she supposedly got into an argument with her boyfriend that, that she was living with and uh, ended up stabbing him to death at four in the morning, left Damn. with her kids got on the 405 freeway, slowed down, and pushed out her nine-year-old who was holding her eight-month-old. Ah, so the eight-month-old yeah. died. She yeah, was hit. hit by a car. Yeah. And the nine-year-old made it to the uh, shoulder of the, the highway. So shortly after that, she ran in uh, 120 miles into Shit. some trees so and the killed herself. Old, just didn't have talent. Get out of the way. <laughs> She's up there with Sydney. <laughs> oh. oh. Hey, There's lady. a cripple in the sky for our love. Oh. Oh. Sydney Wonder on keys. <laughs> what did little brother say to his little sister? I don't know. Car! <laughs> you guys are terrible. Is that a little boop boop? Oh. 
<laughs> no. How did you get here? <laughs> <laughs> so Sydney's intake person. Huh? <laughs> How did you get here? I only lasted for 17 days. Baby Heaven now <laughs> taking new members. <laughs> we ain't shit. We, yeah, we, we go. All right, continue. Thank you. Excuse me, you passed the age limit. <laughs> All right, cool. Well, at least, I mean, come on. Your mom's up there helping them babysitting. <laughs> wow. Oh, you just got to... Dan and I feel you right now. No, no, no. I haven't said not a word. <laughs> Jeff's dad teach him how to play ball. <laughs> Use your left now. Don't look at my eye. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. My be... dad was an OJ fan, so he can meet him now. <laughs> oh, gargling and balls, honey. <laughs> oh, yes. <coughs> yes. Um, okay, two bongs up for upcoming projects that are in the works. According to The Hollywood Reporter, there is a new Michael Jackson biopic coming out. <laughs> Yeah, with his nephew, right? Playing it, playing it, right? Yeah, hopefully yeah. it ain't Flex. Remember Flex? That was played? That was bad. <laughs> I think we had him on a show. We were talking about yeah, um, him playing Michael Jackson. He always say, I got paid. He always mm-hmm. says, I got paid. Mm-hmm. He got paid. Yeah. yeah. He got a nice little chunk Well, according to, I guess it's going to probably be um, a few episodes because the biopic is four hours long and mm-hmm. will Damn. include 30 Michael Jackson songs. Reportedly, yeah, like so you said, Speedy, his nephew, Jafar Jackson, stars as Michael in the biopic. And there's he a, do, I think he does the um, the play. Yeah, he does the play. And they said he, he killed. He looks like he Michael, yeah. though. Yeah, he said he does it really well. Yeah, yeah. well, we know how it ends. So. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> With a nap. Um, there's oh. an all, um, Antoine. <laughs> there you go. Propofol <laughs> Pictures presents. <laughs> Sleepy. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Sleepy works. <laughs> um, Antoine Fuqua is going to be directing it, and it's Lionsgate Universal Pictures. No word when it's coming out, but people like Lorenz Tate, Nia Long, will be playing Katherine Jackson, oh, wow. um, Michael's good. mom. Um, so look for that. They're already shooting it. It's going to be done. Yeah, they uh, showed a, the trailer since February. Um, at February? one of the films. They've been shooting festivals. since February. Oh, since February. Yeah, they, Antoine, he's directing it. Yeah, Fuqua. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He ain't get Lilo. Come on, I know the dude. I know the dude doing the music for it. And you said it's a four-part series. Well, no, I don't know it's what parts it is, but uh, the producer said it's like four hours long. So I'm Damn. sure they're going to probably chop that Wait, up. At least to three. Gotta get it down three. Nobody can sit in the movie for four. Three didn't yeah. sit. Um, Flavor Flav returns back to reality what? TV. Oh, Flav in love. He Flav. doing another Flav. love. Somebody love. He is not doing any more relationship shows. Oh, okay. This time he's out to get his high school diploma. Oh wow, well, that's gonna be a while. <laughs> <laughs> he got time. <laughs> Slave C-C-9. says. <laughs> Slave says. Well, at least um, he know, well, he'll get there on time. <laughs> he gotta go through remedial classes first. That's fucked but up. But he got a clock on his chest. He'll be there. Oh, yeah, he be on time. <laughs> Flav says that he is going back to high school to get his diploma, not a GED. Diploma. He's going diploma. back to high school to so get high his school actual high school diploma. Yeah, high school. Wrong with that. Lord. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Congratulations. You're never too late. It'll probably help the kids, too. Because the kids are going to be on uh, television. Yeah, well, congratulations yeah. to Flav. Is this also. in New York? Is where, is where he's at? He's, right? He lives in Vegas, yeah. I believe. Oh, that's right. Yes. Yeah, sure sure okay, let me ask you a question, Poetis. You said congratulations. I don't feel, I feel like we should congratulate this fool. Because he's using it to, and not you. No, no, not no. Not you, not you. I was congratulating him on his sobriety. That's where oh, okay. I was going okay. with oh, it. Oh, okay, I'm sorry, okay. Um, he Real had been. <laughs> Pre-com. <Yeah. laughs> she didn't say that. She said it kind of late, though. Wow. She was, she, I was well, going she, there she before I was interrupted. I'm yeah. sorry. Uh-huh. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Finish. Yeah, yeah so I point. was congratulating Flav because for many years he was known to kind of be a fuck up in the group and getting high and all that. So now he has been um, sober for a few years now. Um, so Man, I thought you said 30 years. <laughs> but two years. Tico, go ahead, look. I want to hear what you no, say. I wanted to finish. Oh, yeah. Okay. And then, you know. Yeah, so it doesn't say how long he's been sober. But he's been sober for at least a few years now. Mm-hmm. So. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. And that's the POTUS report. I, I, I'm just, it's just people get applauded for doing things. I mean, he's ignorant in that respect mm. that now we're wow. supposed to watch him. At 60 years old. Get his diploma. Yeah. Oh, not 60 something. Not his wow. GED. Oh, when there are so many people who are doing the right thing and we don't applaud oh, them. But that's America. That's yeah. who we are. Well, and that's us. Because I, earlier the, the guys called in and said, well, Danny, why are you always doing black people? But this is the kind of thing, what you just said. We need to hold each other accountable. Why are we giving this guy praises when there's other people that are doing it right, going to college, getting an education. Well, let now, me ask you like this. Are there, is there anything in any of your lives that you wished that you had accomplished that you may try to accomplish now or you just said forget it? No, no, I, just, I, no I, I with, I'm with you. There are things in my life that I wish I had done better. Grew hair. And I'd like to... <laughs> <laughs> you said career? Grew hair. <laughs> oh, grow hair. I thought you said career, which no. would have been just as funny. Your, yo, no, your career is good. Um, so, yeah, I, I agree with you on that. It's just that it seems like we're, this kid, this guy is being highlighted, and it seems like he's been highlighted for just a number of ignorant things. Mm-hmm. And we keep applauding totally him agree. and paying him. And now him. something simple as uh, getting your, well, your, your GED I mean, or your we're, diploma. We're, we're putting on the fact that this is a not so good looking guy, and then he's got the flavor of love, his ignorance with the clock, and it's just we're highlighting this ignorance, and he's making money off of it. And it just frustrates I love me. I, I, it's not that we don't. I, I, I like him, but I think yeah. you're absolutely right. We keep. We keep praising stuff that really, to me, it should have been done. Could she you, said, "Could you not say that? What? That I'm actually right, and I agree with you. Just say your thing." Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't bond with me. Dang, I apologize. <laughs> no, but, no, but I'm just saying. You know, I mean, I. I don't. This is what I say when we try to hold people accountable. We seem to find us as black people seem to find some type of, oh, this is great. He's finally getting himself together. Okay, so he ain't doing drugs. Well, think about the people that haven't done any drugs that are doing it, and think about the people that haven't done anything wrong in their life and didn't get a chance. You know what I mean? Right. For some some type of reason. I don't. I don't. I'm happy he's doing it. I don't know what he's yeah, getting out of it. I don't want to. But I'm not gonna yeah. watch it. But TDP, your point on it. Well, both of you guys took the female response. <laughs> <laughs> this man went around a hunt, over 100 countries in one of the most prolific groups ever, yeah, spitting that knowledge. Good point. Shout out to Danny. So if he's going the other way in life to go back and get what he yeah, should have got, with what's that? wrong with that? The man entertains you. Yeah. The fuck out of here. Okay. Just because he entertain us don't I mean, mean that we have to agree with him going back. No, no, you mean? no, I hear TDP's point. Yeah, but that's crazy. But also... But to call him a fool and ignorant and all that is like that. Ain't I told totally I'm sorry. Okay, okay. I'm saying when I say let me clarify. Stupid. When I say fool and ignorant in the no. sense of of what he's selling, he is selling. He's selling that. himself. Yeah, he's selling himself, and part of the selling is I'm going to sell this ignorant part of myself. No, that's, and what that's, they, okay. that's, that's not what, what that's who what, he is. What do you find ignorant about him? I find your nose ignorant. <laughs> 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 Flav is very in, I mean he's I've, right, I've right. known Flav for a then long you know time what? he's then, not then, then I'm gonna I'm ignorant. gonna rethink that yeah and I'm watch give the it, show I'm gonna give it some, I'm not gonna watch the show but I'm gonna give it some thought the man I'm, told you motherfuck him and John Wayne yeah. <laughs> right he didn't say that he did oh, yes, uh, he oh, did, did Public Enemy who said that who wrote that lyric did Flav did Flavor Chuck Flav D. like Chuck D wrote that lyric who delivered it who sure. delivered the line? Okay, but did he? Write, but you said that like, he said that he didn't write that lyric. He said it. Okay, he it's said on it. Record. Yeah, but he said it. Did he write it? Hey, I hold don't on. Know. I wasn't there. All right, thank you. Hey, homie. First of all, what? Watch your tone. He wrote, <laughs> don't believe the hype. <laughs> Talking to Tita. Watch your motherfucking tone. You got your mustache you back. You now you're feeling yourself. <laughs> you the last one to speak up on hip hop. No, no, you're right. And what you see. And, and that's part of my to education. Me, what you see on television is really his personality. He's not. Okay. I don't think he's hamming up for the camera. That's how Flav is off camera. Okay, I'll, st- I'll stand corrected. But I'm still going to have ready. my point. I'm, I'm going to still have my, my feeling is that I feel that a lot of times. We sell certain things, like you said, TDP, that they that's what they project, and he's also enhancing that. Mm-hmm. By he's, en- he's enhancing himself, and they're funding him doing himself. Okay, so he's making money off that, selling that. Like that's an what, Al Jolson type okay. situation. Okay, well, that makes my, my point. It's Al Jolson, and I think that we need to, we don't see the other side of Al Jolson. We see the black face, but can we? My thing is, can we see the other face? Yeah, you don't see the fifteen Rolls Royces in his garage. You don't. You don't see that part. How do we know it's fifteen? I'd rather see. Okay, no, I'm with you. So I think there's definitely 
that's part of the great debate and good thing about having dialogue with different men. Yeah. Because I might think a certain way, you, you do. know a certain way. Yeah, you do. You think a certain way. My way might be different than yours. It's elitist. See the point. No, I don't think from where I'm sitting there. It it's my. It's just elitist. like yours. You, I can't say that yours is ignorant. Like you said, I can't say that, right? Yeah. You could. All right, I could, that's but that's good, not. Yeah. That's not fair. So mine's not elitist. That's just how I think, and that's how Dan and I might feel. I feel the same. I mean, oh, now you want to bond with him now? Yes, <laughs> I gotta have somebody on I my think, side. I think yeah. in this world, could you do me a favor though? Could you? <laughs> <by> yourself, <laughs> right? yeah. When you hear someone say, "Well, this is how I feel," to me, I don't think you stop the conversation because you're never going to change how someone feels. So the minute they go, "Well, this is how I feel," then I leave it alone because you're not going to change their thought. <laughs> that's how they feel. It's a feeling. I let it go. And well, I'll no, that's on. the beauty of being around men. You feel like men. that in the drive-thru? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I think that's about being around men that's that, a you feeling. that you respect and care about. You can get better. Right. You can get better. And that's what he's doing. I, I've learned things from him that I didn't want to learn. Do you know? Do you believe you're kind of harsh guy to be around? Of course. Okay. And I, and that's do you what, believe that there's no hair on this side of your head? <laughs> <laughs> there's a patch in the front. Why are you? Your baby hair coming in, though. We just talk about practice. We sitting here. I supposed to be the franchise. That's what I'm looking at from this side. About practice. If I wish one of your guys had children, if I could kick them in the fucking head or stomp on their testicles, so you can feel that pain. Because that's the pain I have. I wish I was 50 years younger and I'd kick that's your ass. ass. That's from the end. Oh, we look like the damn bad news bear. TD Sports ticker, rest in power, OJ Simpson. Ah. Run, OJ, run. Remember um, the Battle of the Network Stars? And, yeah. And all that in there? They used to film that out in Malibu. Yeah. How was it that? Yeah. Gabe Captain, Robert Conrad, yeah. OJ. He used to be the MC, right? Yeah. OJ? Oh, I don't think he yeah, did it. I think yeah. he was the, yeah, he was the MC. Huh? Yeah. Gabe Captain. Yeah. All those guys. We're going to cut through the fat. Yeah. Oh, wow. But um, <laughs> it's going to take a minute to get through you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. You need OJ to cut the net back. <laughs> Tootsie Roll! <laughs> Tootsie Roll! To the left! <laughs> to the left! Hut one. To the left! Number one, South Carolina. You can't roll them over to the right. Female Gamecocks. <laughs> mm hmm. Took out the Iowa girls. Great game. 2024 National Champion. Their third. Yeah. Championship in school history. Game she's, she's among the greats. Now, rebound the with a 51 to 29 offensive rebound, 70, mm. 18 to 7. Uh, paint points was 30 to 16. Uh, bitch paint. points was 37 to nothing. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. That's what hurt points, man. That's what hurt him. Yeah, he's, he's hard to win. The bitch gets you 30. No, no points. Plus hard they, to win. They outdid the men. Absolutely. With the numbers. Yep. Oh, 18.9. Uh, million watch Sunday. All three games outdid the men. Yeah. No, two of them did. So you all just not going to let him do his segment? No, he, he bringing up a good point. That was the most watched female yeah. Yeah. finals in history. And you what don't have that in your segment? Go to sleep. And, and when you address me, uncross your arms. Mm. Have a manly posture. Yeah. He's trying to show my arms. <laughs> well, you're doing a bad job of that. <laughs> so congratulations to Don Staley, who uh, received a $250,000 oh. <laughs> bonus Bam. Damn. for winning the championship. And the end of the season, will collect six hundred and eighty with a bonus addition, making the amount $3.1 million. Go ahead, girl. In her salary. Go ahead, coach. And she got commercial. North Philly. <laughs> North she Philly. Philly. Dobbins Tech. Okay. Yeah. Congratulations, Miss Staley. You did the damn thing, Coach. UConn men's basketball. Yeah, right? two. the two big boys going at it. Yeah, beat the brakes off them. Boys. Man, UConn Huskies, back-to-back -back champions. Um, and he's coming back. He's not going to Kentucky. They kept thinking he might leave to go to Kentucky. No, they coming back. The coach. The coach. Is coming back. Yeah, Dan Hurley. Yeah. Yeah, and here's back. the thing about. Um, on the ball. They had a 6'6 six, six point guard on the ball. So, no, it was big it's hard all to beat. the way around yeah. the horn. So, the little Europeans couldn't get their shot off. And they're all, uh, this their year to leave? The... I don't no. Know. Okay. You can look that up yourself, sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Kidding off. Uh, what you want to know. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thought it was a sports segment. St. Joe segment. It's number 13 a senior. <laughs> Still right here. <laughs> Did he on prime? Is 6'6 six, six a senior? <laughs> but um, both big boys look nice. And um, you think my uh, man from NC State, what's his name, Burner? DJ Burns. DJ Burns. Is he going to yeah. leave? Nah. Speedy 
at that size like that, you got to be a Zion Williams type. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You're right. Yeah. How you going to stick Zion if you go to the next level? You he know was what tired, mean? too. He yeah, it's tired. great footwork, so, though. Great footwork, but he was tired. He, he, he was in yeah, condition. Yeah, he got to lose some weight. He got to get in shape. Yeah, but I pick UConn to take it all the way because they big boy is just so nice. But your bracket was blown up even though you still had to I didn't do a bracket, but I just knew that UConn was going to be there because they had that that strong, strong team. And um, Did you just uh, taste yourself? I did. Okay. <laughs> Nate Robinson, NBA, what? Uh, yeah. needs a kidney. Little Nate? Yeah. yeah no, he needs a little kidney. Mm. <laughs> OJ Two got one. After okay. Come on. got cancer. <laughs> announcing his yeah, prostate cancer. Yeah, renewal cancer failure diagnosis, Nate Robinson admitted it does not have long to live. So, uh, um, how long? Nate. Not long. So he's fighting cancer. I don't know what round he's in, but <laughs> he's definitely fighting. No, it's kidneys. Well, he, he don't want to use those. Kidneys. Kidney. Hey, T, let me ask you a quick question. Yes, sir. <laughs> what do, did you guys enjoy the boys' game or the girls' game? More? I enjoy both. Enjoy yeah. both? Yeah. enjoy both. Okay. Same mm-hmm. here. Yeah. yeah. I watched the both. I watched so both. I both, both. Yeah. 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 They were both good games. And um, that's Tita Sports Ticker. Bam. That was Spinach. quick. I'm going to be honest now. I criticize it, but that was really good, TDP. I appreciate oh, wow. it. That was really I good. I just thank my staff. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was really good. For the research. Yeah. yeah, that was really good. It's Absolutely. really good. I'm getting better. And you want to add something to it? Because you're ready to go. Mm, Kate nah. Clark. Yeah, Kate and Clark fan. What's up? With well, that? She's going in the first. Oh, pick. What, the first pick. You, what, what is your question to me? Now, okay, here's the thing that I noticed, and maybe what? you can comment on that. Yeah. That CNN. Show the picture of Iowa's team when they were referring to the national championship and not, yeah, not yeah. everybody not got. I, I'll say real yes. quick. Oh wow! Everybody online has been getting upset because uh, they've been giving Caitlin Clark more pub than every team that she's beaten. The last three teams, right? Connecticut, LSU, and then definitely South Carolina. And you know, people came on on social media and said, "Oh, but then you just went." I said, "No, you guys understand." I said something and people got offended. I said, black people, we're the reason that she's getting the juice. One of the reasons. What do you mean by that? Well, everybody, because with Diana Taurasi, so so say the women from the WNBA. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I heard what she said. Ourselves, right, right. Anytime you go on social media and you're making a negative comment about something, that algorithm picks it up. So all she's been getting is dogged out from the LSU game to the Connecticut game and to South Carolina. So she's the person that is pushing the needle. Who are we talking about? I'm sorry. Kate McClard. Okay. okay. All right, hold that because you have your yeah. segment. And I want to go to the uh, – Go ahead. We have an excellent – I thought it was hilarious. Uh, we're going to do Jet Beauty of the Week. And then Speedy has a segment now, even though this is only oh, wow. his third week. <laughs> I don't know how that came about. I don't know who he donated to. Oh, it's, can I do something? And, and shout <laughs> yeah. out to Mark, uh, Mark Weiss. My boy. What was his name? Mark. Oh, Mark. Mark. I almost said Mark Atkins, but Mark Weiss, who donated, oh, he gave okay. me a call and said, what is the uh, donation information? And he donated. My you, man. Mark. Mark. Now, he was been cool with you because he gave you a job that you didn't do well. Wow. <laughs> he had me cleaning toilets. Hey, man, nothing wrong with cleaning toilets. It is. Nobody was around. That's Just right, you in though. the toilet. Yeah, and he's like taken it. care of me since day one when mm. I came to the Willows. And he's taking care of a lot of people. Yeah, mm-hmm. uh, he's just a he's shout just out to a, him. Thank you, man. He's just a good person. And shout out to his family. No, he's cool. His w- lovely wife it. and his daughters and uh, his brother. That's his family, Lou. Right. Got you. <laughs> <laughs> he's been a consistent, honest man. Yeah. And he took me to the Eagles game and had a great. Oh, he still at he still at Willows. Yeah, he's still at Willows. Oh, yeah. oh whoa! Oh, we got oh. a Dutch game one finally. Oh, yeah, and and <laughs> yes. And and whoever said something That's a dude Co- man Code three read the uh some some Real? comments comments and said that somebody said that I'm showing all you the are. Uh, ones that look like my ex. You are. You I'm are. I don't pick those. Why are you getting mad at me? I'm you just telling you boss lady picks those. Because you suggest them, you put an X by it. No, I don't. But this is <laughs> Serena. Is that how you say it? Serena is a native of Charlotte, North Carolina, 5'9", mm. model, actress, and flight attendant. Mm. Likes reading and watching <laughs> yeah, <whatever>. dramas. <laughs> now, would you hit? Would I hit? Yeah. I'm committed. Is there an echo in here? <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you do repeat shit. I, I'm Do I not have hair? Yeah. What the fuck is that? <laughs> 
I'm committed right, to that code. <laughs> if that was code three, yeah, I'd hit. Say it again. Would you hit? Yeah, heck yeah. She is beautiful. I was the one that said we need to have more dark skinned women up there. Did Impossible. we see her again? Look you at her down. great teeth. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her yeah. chin. She's cute. My God. Nice she stomach. Got no, she ain't got no, two skin. She ain't got no what? She ain't got no breasts. <laughs> No, we, can, we, can, we can buy those. Yeah, yeah give them yours. Mine's <laughs> <laughs> not bigger than hers. Yeah. Really? Would you hit? She's bigger breasts than Popeyes. No, Speedy wouldn't hit. Oh, yeah. yeah, she's not, she's not white. <laughs> not white. Yeah. She's not white. Yuck. Bigger. I'd walk right past her. <laughs> and now we have a new segment. Yeah. Um, it's a Ross. debut? Yes. Debut? Oh. Hold on a second. Oh, and wow. it is called Speedy's can I say what it's called? Oh, it's Please on the do. paper? It's on, yeah, yeah, it's that on makes the paper. it feel speedy. <laughs> segment, yeah. segment six. Speedy, what, is it, Jeff? what is it called? Seg Club. six. Speedy's Club Fluffies. Could yeah. you say it with some more? Mm. Speedy's Club. Oh, this is a classic. Speedy's Club Fluffy. Yes. You guys talk a little more because I forgot. Oh, wow. That's so good. Got I got the opener, Can but I forgot to sit in there. You pictures. got one job. <laughs> one job. I got Police never happened on the view. I got a hundred jobs. And I respect everyone. Watch your tone. Jeff and I are going to hang out. I invited him to the rap party. Okay. And uh, you've been to a rap party. Hmm? Wow. He says he knows Billy Gardell. Uh, Billy I Gardell. Gave, I gave everyone, not everyone, but most people that I interacted with, thank you cards hmm. um, to thank them for you know giving me. What he doesn't know, I'm just going to drop him off. <laughs> it's not far from the crib, so yes. I'm going to go. I was going to invite. It was either going to be you, you, or you, but he said yes first. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, who'd you call first? Well, yeah, yeah, you asked him first. Well, because I needed a ride because my son has the car. And shout out to my son Lou. He is young uh, Lou. He's got a job. Oh, another one. He got he in, he that? increased his hours. He's, he's working like what you do. He's in the homes helping. Group homes. Yeah, group homes. Wh- which one is he at? He's over the one on uh, Martin Luther King and uh, off that way, off 141st place. Uh, he, he runs it. Yeah, he doesn't run. I mean, you know, oh. you go and sit there. He's a council company. You go sit there with yeah. them, and yeah. he's, he's, he's drinking, increased his he's drinking with Wednesday them? and Thursday. Yeah. That was his and degree Friday in? Saturday. Lewis? No, his degree is in marketing. Okay. But we need to get him a job. Do it something. Yeah. And he's yeah. always up at night, so he does seven. Oh, he's overnight. He does, oh. yeah, 11 to 7. Uh, oh. On Wednesday and Thursday, it's at 3 to 11. Oh, yeah, he's going to be drinking. Seven oh, yeah, they sleep, man. Yeah. And do they have breakfast in the morning? Yeah, they do. He has to make him breakfast and get him the meds if they take him. So he has to actually cook the breakfast? Yeah. Yeah, the kids you work there. It's too? called a job. No, no, not there. But I, I work in group home settings and I worked at five acres before. So, in other places so like I wanted that. to ask you, so do you is that gonna help him? In, yeah. In what way will that help him? Um I've Drink learned patience. I've learned patience yeah, working right. with kids. But it's gonna help him find I'm himself ready. and discover himself. We'd love to keep talking to you. We're ready. Okay, they are ready. <laughs> Sorry, Lou, you you see the stage Debut. Wait a minute, I got an opener for you, Speedy. Oh, I'm sorry. And why does Jeff do not have a segment? Because he doesn't bring title topics when I ask for them. Wow, exposed. <laughs> job, man. Yeah, we know. good, good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, right, yeah. there it is. Set it up, good, boss good. lady. Set it up. All right, here we go. The debut of Club Fluffy. Yes. Oh, that's gay. <laughs> it's gay. <laughs> it's gay looking. Oh, there you go, baby girl. That's what I'm talking about. Whoa. Oh, that's him right there. That's what's feeling like right there. Welcome to Club Fluffies right Whoa. here. Get it out of I got everybody got a job at Club Fluffies. As you could probably tell, beautiful. Go back. Just run. Oh, oh. That's oh. His, that's I didn't send like. you that one. I, I did. Kill you. I still would much. hit that. That's too much. Um, hmm. Welcome to Club Fluffy. <laughs> Tita's going to be working the bar. What that was too, you much got for <laughs> <laughs> That's too much salmon. Tita's no, working no, the bar. Hold up. Let TV say that. What did you say, Tita? Oh, too, too much salmon. Much salmon. <laughs> <laughs> it's too much Why salmon. Why did you need to underline that? Let, let it go. This shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> Tita's working the bar. What kind of drinks you got for the ladies, Oh, Tita? for the ladies. Now we got biscuits and bourbon. <laughs> oh, <right. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, go to the bar and get your biscuits and bourbon on ice. Uh, on Louis, I, would, I would love for you to work the door. Can you work the door? Yeah, they just need two pieces of ice. <laughs> <laughs> Could you guys wait right here? Because <laughs> one is uh, not going to show the full. Uh, oh who my you are. God. And, uh, I was hoping you guys could do security. Yeah, but, yeah, because well, you need four hands to lift all the bellies up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Jeff? No, I'm gonna do the bathroom. You gonna <laughs> the bathroom. They got one stall. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Welcome it's gonna be a long wait. Beautiful sisters, uh, I uh, plan on. Uh, yeah, no, here's the I, first one. Now, mm. now, oh, yeah, she is fine. Absolutely gorgeous. She is fine. Yes. I mean, she's lighter than you would go with those people. No, no, no. That's it right there. Oh, okay, that's yeah, it. Normally they well, all white. No light. I said lighter, not yeah. white. Now she is beautiful. Uh, I'd have to. That's that's, just, that's, that's you, about you, four you, beers. Yeah, in the, in really? the, wow. In the French she's cute. <laughs> she's cute. Go to the next one. She's cute. Gorgeous. Oh, oh, right. oh. oh, oh yes. yeah, she can get it. Now, see, that's not even big to me. I, I oh, can think that. Now, that's outfit fine. Yeah. It's the outfit that's making her look cute. Oh, oh no. She's a beautiful oh, no. woman. She is. Mm. Now, that looks slim for you. Like, no, she's too small for you. No, that's Look at those perfect. thighs. What are you talking about? Is that what you call them? Them is ham hocks right there. Them is hair crushers. Them oxtails. Those are sandwiches. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Now. Hold up real quick. Jeff said, they watch Jeff? Oxtail. Thank you, Jeff. All right, go ahead. That was funny. So if you want to submit to Big Girl. Huh? Big Beauty of the Week. Big Bang Hank. I am the proprietor. Big Bat. Who? <laughs> the proprietor of the club. If you would love to submit you like your pepperoni. picture or someone you may know, hit me at Speedy is funny on everything. Speedy Iz yeah, funny. Yeah, a family member. And uh, <laughs> drop in a picture. Oh yeah, if you got a, a sister, cousin. Yeah, it's my family. You know what the problem? Hold up, boss lady. Can Break you house. Go back through those again and just hold them so we can look at them. Yes. Nice. For sure. Yes. Very, very for sure. Okay. Yes. Uh-huh. That one. Someone said in the chat room looks like it's AI generated. Oh no, it's not. Not that kneecap. Oh, you, you that know. kneecap is real. No, yeah. no those. But are you know what they all have? In, he said the kneecap. In common, they all look like they hard to wake up. Oh damn! They that do. Is, <laughs> that is that is funny. Sometimes you bowl the ball to go down the middle. Now, can you go through the other ones no. and the ones you showed in the beginning? Oh, let me it ain't cheating. It ain't cheating. Who is she? <laughs> <laughs> she cute. I like that. I like the red. Yes, you do. No. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Nope. Yes. Nope. Yes. 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 No. No. Yes. 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 No. Nope. No. No. Nope. Nope. Bad pose. Yeah. See, bad positioning. That's too no. much salmon right no. there. That's no, that's of, too much. That's right a lot there. of woman right there. Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. Thank you guys. I appreciate so, that. Now, now, Speedy. Yes. You got a segment fast. You got music, graphics. It's like you. Well, I sent that took in. me two. Sure. Took me a year and a half to get something. But it's what? Okay. What part of them have turned you on? What parts of them? I'm sorry. The eating. The, <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> Why you got to sound like that? Why you That's how like they bigger? sound. Wait, say that again. I'm hungry. <laughs> you going to finish that on your plate? <laughs> Why you say it's a Popeye's down the street? <laughs> Caller. You look like Are you heavy? <laughs> <laughs> what up, man? It's Poo Lee, man. Poo Lee. What you think of the girls, Poo? Hey. Hey, speaking of fluffing, man, the funniest show y'all had, man, when you had when you had the big girl calendar. Oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> and uh yeah. and, and, and Lou and Corey Holcomb roasted them girls. <laughs> yeah. Like Alan Haynes were. Oh, yeah, man. man. Oh. That's uh, yeah, funny. No, that was a funny yeah, oh, man. Yeah, that was a funny What's up, Pooley? Hey, how are you, Pooley? Oh uh, man, I, hey, speaking of the group home, I mean, I used to work at one, man. And uh re- reason why I stopped working at them, man, cause uh when those people get 18, they just throw them out. You know what I'm saying? They just did something to them, man. I couldn't, I stopped working there. They supposed to save money for them, but see, they don't do it. Hey, Pooley, oh, let me man. ask you, let me ask you a question. We're in, we're in April now. So December hit. Do you feel your year is going the way that you feel you wanted to go? Oh yeah, man. I'm making, a, I'm making a difference in kids' lives, man. <laughs> yeah, teacher. Hey, yeah. Oh, you got the key to all the balls. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know, oh, I got the gym job, time. man. P.E., bro. That's the easy money. That's right. Yeah, there you go. That's yeah. right, Pooh Lee. What did they call you? What did the kids call you? Coach D. Coach D. All right. What's okay, your you woman call you? Man. <laughs> Coach D. Little D. <laughs> hey, Pooh Lee. I stopped coaching. That's too much stress, man. I I, I stopped coaching basketball. Wow. Hey, Polly, I was thinking the other day, and I actually had a great conversation with my friend, uh, Dr. Bill Cosby. Uh, mm. Name dropping. Drop. Yeah. No, definitely. Did you that. check your drink before you drunk it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, he fell asleep. So, you know, no, maybe. I was going to have a hoagie. Was he a pimp?
feeling. <laughs> <laughs> and um, he, we were talking, and we were talking about coaches. And um, I, I want, because nowadays, I mean, the thing about coaches is you have to really feel out a kid. Okay. You have to feel out, you know, if you get third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh up to high school, you have to feel out what. Why do you keep feeling on them? Yeah. No, in the sense of what, what, what gets them, what makes, what motivates Who them, cares? what makes them. And I'm sure you had to deal with the same thing with your son, mm -hmm. finding out athletically what, what makes mm -hmm. him click. So, Paulie, uh, shout out to you for doing that. Oh, Absolutely. Yeah. What's one of the consistent? Oh yeah, I got you a sports question too, Lou. All right. What's one of the consistent things that you you found that helps you connect with a child or athlete? Because I'm, I'm myself. I'm not fake with them. Got it. So consistency. Yeah. Just being real. I teach them about time. life, man. Life, life is going to be hard, man. Yeah. It ain't going to be easy. Yeah. Well, it depends on where you live. Yeah. Now, do you en you, did you, know, you enjoy but, it? But what gets, me, what gets me is the suburban kids that try to act hard. I just don't get that. Because they, think it's, cool. they got, think it's cool. You got a house, two, your mom and dad, you still want to be gangsters. Right. Yeah, That's we know some people like that. Right. I applaud you, know you Polly. I applaud all coaches, and I applaud you. Yeah. Let but me I can ask you how you feel about Kyler Perry going to Arkansas. Oh, is he going to Arkansas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he, he signed Five, yeah, to yeah. deliver. Yeah. But you know, Arkansas got. You know, but you know, Arkansas got Walmart and Tyson Chicken though. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. But here's the thing: is he gonna keep going after those one and dones, or is he gonna go get some, go down that portal and grab some? Of them I mean, you could do that at Arkansas because they. Ain't, I mean, you could do that at Arkansas. They ain't trying to win. They just want to be in the Sweet Sixteen Elite Eight. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That sponsorship. Paul Lee. Yeah. Yeah. How, how, how are you, as man to man? How, how are you doing mentally? Oh, man, I'm great. I'm alive, man. It's a blessing every time I wake up, Lou. That part. There you go. See, it's a part every time I wake up. Yeah, Take out the trash. Now, Shit, now we woke you, up. Uh, OJ didn't. Now, he didn't wake up. Now, when hey, you hey, wake, hey. Now, when you wake up. If the glove don't fit. Polly, uh, when you wake up and you decide, so I got to get this day on and I'm walking <laughs> into that school, what do you tell yourself on the way when you're driving, heading to the school, knowing what you have to deal with? with all I hope I don't have to kill one of these little motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> I know, make a difference in somebody's life today. They better have all That's my hours, I know that. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you say that you know you have to, you're making a difference in someone's life. Yeah, because you don't do it for the money, brother. Uh okay. Well, I applaud you. Yeah. Uh, seriously. Pooley. You're an unsung yeah. you're an unsung hero. Wait a minute. Pooley, did OJ oh, yeah, do yeah. it? No, nah, if the glove if the glove doesn't fit, must, must quit. quit. Okay. okay. That's right. right. Moving on. Right. Hey man, I'm I'm coming to LA. Hey, I need to so? <laughs> man. Better check in before you come. Yeah, yeah, you better yeah, check yeah. in. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna show them I'm gonna show them how to uh, shot town step. You know what I mean? Oh, all right, all right, so. I'll be at the dime. Come show yourself. Cause the so. LA the LA step ain't got nothing on shot town. Hey, no, watch them out. Watch them out. Coming? When you coming? When you coming LA? When you coming? Early in July, man. All right. All right. So set July. Oh, yeah. You coming? You gonna oh, hook yeah. up with Jeff? You got an Airbnb. <laughs> <laughs> You can stay at OJ's place. <laughs> oh, he got there. All right, man. Y'all be, be safe, my boy. All right, All right. We look forward Poli. to meeting. We look forward to meeting. An Apollo legend. Yeah, when you come, Poli, make sure you let us know so we'll all come down. You probably won't come down. Where? To the Dunn? Yeah. Yeah. All right, right, so let's oh, do that. Oh, you been to the Dunn? Yeah. So Did let's do Jefferson? that. When Poli comes. You got mad bitches, son. <laughs> <laughs> when Ask Poli, him that. Poli, if you're still listening, when you come down, let us know and we'll all meet you down here just to buy you a drink. Yeah. Hang out with you. Yeah, hang out with you. That'd be cool. And anybody, excuse me, anybody that's listening and you come to L.A., you hit us up, hit Poetus up at the, the on the show, let her know you're coming in, and we'll meet you down there and buy you a drink. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How's your brother? He's better. Good. good. A little nervous, though. A little yeah, nervous, you know. He a heart attack. He heart attack. Is um, he a heart attack? He... Yeah, his ex, who's an evil woman, uh, he well, called, called her. Me. He called her, like, we don't know why. And we think that a lot of the stress was from her. Oh, my God. So he's, just, he's just weak at that point. Now, Can we get him on the show? Yeah, I'd love for him. to. I love him. And, and I don't talk to him enough, and I apologize for that. I'm not good at that. Are you good at comedic? Uh, hmm? <laughs> are you good at, I don't like college cheese. Are, are you good yeah. at communicating with your family members? Yeah, when they die. <laughs> Now, got a lot to say. Now, yeah. Are you? Yes. Speedy, you yes, are. Yes. I talk to my 
I try to talk someone in. I'm going to skip you. Yes, I plead the fifth. How are you? I know you talk to your mom a lot. And your yeah, dad, talk, I'm sure you, you yeah, say I hello. I talk to my dad, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I talk to my brothers all the time. Okay, I'm not good at yeah. that. And, and I, I called my mom today, and I got to get better at it. Uh, Code 3 calls my mom and my dad more than I do. And, and I'm not, I don't I mean, know why dad, man, that cool, is. Man, man. Yeah. I don't. I don't know what. Good guy. In my well, you're mind. more than welcome because you know Sydney's at the house. You're more than welcome to come and communicate with her. No, I just don't know. Poetess, do you, Bosley? Do you? Are you good at communicating with your family? Yes. Yeah, please. Me and my brothers are real yeah. tight. Um, we text each other randomly to tell you, you know, we love each other. And I talk to my mom every day. Which is weird because when you were younger, you didn't really <clears throat> say I love you. As you got older. I've said that to my brothers, brothers and sisters all the time. How many brothers and sisters do you have? Seven. It's seven of us all together. Oh, your mom was out there. <laughs> 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 Who wants some of this kitty cat? Kitty cat. Oh, my Who want God. it? Who want it? Who yeah, want it? Guys are Did you bring wrong. gloves? No, I left them at home, but. <laughs> well, we know you, she met your dad at the, at the supermarket. So. <laughs> What, 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 what aisle was that? What aisle was that? I don't want no blubber, but don't wear no rubber. <laughs> oh, so wait, damn. your mom had seven kids by the same dad? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> no, how many? How many different daddies? Uh, one, two, three. Why are you whispering? <laughs> Count them up. <laughs> Count them up. Count them up. <laughs> them up. Giving them up. You my daddy. <laughs> Go no, on, but boy. Heard my no, show. but I'm your mama. <laughs> People that heard my show know that when hmm? she met the guy who became my dad, she was pregnant with me already. And then, so when she had me, he gave me his name. <laughs> and then so you went to the supermarket, Ralph's, to and met your other, dad. My real yeah, dad. Your, dad yes. your biological one. What, really? Hey, little fat boy, you want some meat or not? <laughs> you staring at me. Now, now, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. So, take a ticket. T- take a so <laughs> ticket, your, nigga. Your Put mom, a ticket, boy. So Get a number. Your mom is pregnant with you. Boy, these kids are dumb. Meet your stepdad. Does she uh, marry him? Yeah, they get married. And now, you, do you feel he's your dad or you don't yeah, know? Yeah, that's the only person I knew. Okay, so you had never met your dad? Till later on, till I was fourteen. So that fat boy to come in here and eat. <laughs> now, wh- always now, one baloney. Now, no, no, now, when she did, she sit I you down and tell you. She drove me to where. I told the story. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, we we haven't heard the story. Yeah. So, 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 yeah. No, we've heard it here. We've so, heard it here, here before. But go ahead. You're on a different so class. Yeah, so it's seven of us. And the anytime my mother would go somewhere, she would take two or three of us with her. She drops them off. At this particular time, she said, "Speedy, get in the car." Put that popsicle back and let's go. So I get in the car. I just opened it. We go drive. So I lived on uh, 88th and Normandy, and my dad, my step, my dad, who actually bought me in the world, worked at the boys, worked at uh, at ABC Market on yeah. Manchester. Manchester and Hoover. Okay. Mm-hmm. So we pull into the parking lot, and I'm like, I don't know why I'm here, but whatever. And she goes, I got something to tell you. I said, like, What? What's up? Uh, Donald ain't your dad. So I was like, Oh. And then okay, when she, the minute she says that, then all the times that my aunt or someone went. Why is that red boy look different than the other kid? Mm. I never, it never it clicked. You, okay. Yeah, as a kid, who red? <laughs> <laughs> That's a color. That's anyway, big red. So <laughs> he work at the. So then store. everything oh. starts to click, and I'm like, she's like, your real dad's inside. You want to go meet him? I'm like, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> this is fucked up. Is he cute? I go, okay. What do he look like? She goes, well, he's a butcher, but he only had, he cut his fingers off so he can, he got oh, t- So apparently you get. 10, so he wouldn't have been friends with OJ. <laughs> <laughs> I got so these extra many, rib tips so in how my. Many, <laughs> how many fingers did he cut off? Three. And he got 10,000 per digit. He was not good. He wasn't a good person. No, he did it on purpose to get the money. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So now emotionally, <laughs> I'm thinking 14. So you're 14, you're sitting there. What emotions are you going through? Is this nigga going to be some free meat? <laughs> <laughs> you all right? All right, cool. Uh, I don't know. I, I, was I just, shook his hand and my fingers were there. How do I interlock? <laughs> Wait a minute, Portis. Are you playing music under me? How do I interlock? This nigga ain't got no finger. Oh, God. <laughs> he ain't gripping my hand. <laughs> He's going to give a, I can't give him a pound either. This thing. <laughs> I can't give him a pound. <laughs> Anyway, I, I don't remember what it was. Uh, it right. was 14 and uh, <laughs> caught off guard. I don't know. Now, is he still with us? I don't know. 
So, so, so you. So I met him at 14. I didn't see him again until I turned 19, 20, and I needed a car. I'm a man now. <laughs> <laughs> so I needed a car, and I was like, well, shit, I got another daddy. So I went back up there, uh, and I asked him if he could help me. I went to your backup car. dad. Yeah, went back to the, yeah. And he said he had other kids, so he couldn't help mm. me. Oh, wow. What, what daddy hurt? were you in jail with? Don Ray. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, wait. You were in jail with your father? Yeah. So, the Lewis. one is mama like. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Lewis. I'm, I'm, so, at, at uh, if you go to Wayside, they have two different sides. They have people that's actually doing time, and people that's coming in and got to go to court. Right. So, somebody goes, hey, man, there's a dude up there named Donald Caldwell. I was like, man, the fuck, ain't nobody up there named Donald. He's like, yeah, there's a dude up there named Donald Caldwell. So, we, I, we walk up to the hill, and I see my dad. My dad go, what the fuck you doing here? I was like, um. Hmm. Dad, <laughs> what the fuck are you this doing? This is the three finger dad. <laughs> no, it's Donald dad. Oh, your dad, your dad adopted you. The, the one that yeah. your mom married while you were pregnant, while she was pregnant. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Are you all following right. the story? Yeah, I'm just trying to okay. stay with it. Okay. It's not hard. It's tough. <laughs> All right, well, well, all right. So you and Danny need to go to the same thing. <laughs> Hysterical. But, but Danny, have, did you do twenty three and me to find out? No, I, I haven't done it. You yet. should do that, man. Yeah, I probably should. Yeah. I'm surprised you didn't do that. No, nah, I just, find, I just haven't had time. You'll I find guess. out that Jeff's dad is his father. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that'd be, uh, that'd all right, be I'm Lewis Dix. Dan and Green spits the truth, ideas, I'm and I'm 30% stories. Cobra. And, uh, <laughs> with Dan and uh, Green. Nigga, you is ugly. <laughs> 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 What's up, D? It's all good. Well, I, I brought two... But I said I want to do one so I can show the pictures. Did you download the pictures? So let's do the pictures first. Wow. So you mean two stories? Okay, so let's read it. Dan and Green. Okay, Dan and Green to be first black graduate in what's ACCAD? Advanced Computing Center for Arts and Design. I was the first African American accepted into Ohio State's program. And that's you? That's me. Okay. So why do we have this up here? Let's just keep going. <laughs> okay. Nigga look like Lee okay. Harvey Oswald in that picture. We said we was going to bring I stuff. Thought, so that's I thought my, he was Megger Avery. That's me boxing. Ooh. That's me boxing. <laughs> That's me boxing Michael Nunn. That's me boxing Michael Which Nunn. Which one is you? Uh, Mike's on the ropes. That's me throwing a shot at him right there. With, With the, the LGBT. What, where it says <laughs> me on. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Keep going. That's when I said I was 13 and 3. That's my 12 and 1 record right there, if you see it. Oh, Dan and Green. Did you sign that? The bottom part, yeah, I have to sign. So, so All the fighters have to sign there. Colorado Springs. Okay. And, and that's, who's that that? Was, that's me. That was my picture. You have to have a picture in there. A picture in where? In the book. That's inside of the oh, record gotcha, book. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I wish I had a family. <laughs> <laughs> That's me at one of my fights right there. Whose legs? <laughs> your legs look like that. <laughs> <laughs> that made your legs. Now, 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 <laughs> quick question. So the guy to your right. The guy to the guy to my right is Alvino Pena. He used to be Michael Nunn's first trainer. Mm -hmm. So he was training you at the time? Yeah, but this is when I was in college in Iowa. Did he adopt you? Nah, oh. keep, go ahead, go, go again. Um, that's after the fight. I won that fight. Got my medal. Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> you look taller. There, there's the golden gloves yeah. jacket. Everybody said that they wanted to see. There it is right there. So you still have that? Yeah. West Virginia? I told you I won them in Huntington, West Virginia. If okay, you remember. No, no, I'm asking. No, no, I'm, I'm saying, no, I'm, uh, yeah. We yeah. like your tone or delivery. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so defensive. And then that's, that, that's, that's my favorite picture in the world. That's Why? when I was writing. That's me and Muhammad Ali and my trainer. Mm -hmm. the, and that's okay, right before I was going to go in the ring. Yeah. And did you, you win that fight? You won yeah, that I won that fight. And just real quick, you pay so we won't do picture. it again. I'll show that we end here. Did Muhammad Ali sign it? Yes. So I'm going to tell the story. I won't show any video. So what happened with this is, this is the year that Mike Tyson knocked out Buster Douglas. Okay. I mean, Bust, Buster Douglas knocked out Mike Tyson. Got it. Mm -hmm. So Douglas was from Columbus. So at right. the Golden Gloves, Ali and Buster Douglas were down there to sign autographs. Mm -hmm. For $10, you can get a picture with them. Mm -hmm. So I was in line waiting. I paid my money. And... <laughs> No, oh, you still talking? Yeah, oh, it is it's just pretty, second. It was pretty well. Yeah, okay. no, well, I'm not gonna show no videos. Okay. So anyway, I'm just gonna show you about this picture, and then that's it. Right. So then, um, so I was in line waiting, and then as I was waiting, I had my fight was coming up. So my trainer, Vonzel, said, "Yo, you gotta go get laced up." I said, "Well, I paid the picture, get a pit, you know, get a mm -hmm. picture with him." He said, "Nah, you gotta go get laced up." So I went in and I was getting laced. As I was getting laced, Douglas already had left, mm. and Ali was leaving. And so I stopped. I was walking to the from ring, and in, I stopped right Kenya. before. Oh, yeah, well, I stopped to get my picture. Got you. And he said, what's, what's up? I said, man, I paid to get a picture with Ali. He said, man, you got to fight. And the guy, other guy was in the ring. I said, man, I paid $10 to get my picture. So then my trainer called him. He said, yo, the kid said he he paid. And then he said, oh, yeah, he paid. And then Ali walked over to the ring and took a picture. Mm -hmm. And then the reason that you asked Don't if she signed it. Suit. 
Yeah, let me tell you what happened. <laughs> the funny part about the signing of the suit is, Yaya, you remember Yaya? Yeah. yeah. So Yaya comes by my house one day and sees the picture. He goes, man, that's a cool picture, man. I said, yeah. And this one, he was married to Layla. Mm -hmm. And I go, you think you can go you can see if Ali will sign the picture for me? He said, give me the picture. And he gave me, I gave him the picture, and Ali signed the picture for me. It's worth some money. That's the story. So Yaya yeah, yeah, signed it. So, <laughs> so yeah. next week, we want to see the video. I got, I got to find the video. The video, right. fight, of you fighting yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but see, the videos that I have were, Grainy. you remember, VHS, right. So I got to try to get them from that. I have some on, on one of my computers, but I got to see if I got that one. All right, yeah. We yeah. Love yeah. Any yeah. video. Yeah, yeah anyone. Well, you know, you see me speak. People seem to hit me no, hit the bag and I've stuff. I've never seen. We've never okay, I'll, I'll show, I can show you some I, of that. Are you yeah. gonna submit pictures and, and videos? Yeah, I met, I forgot all about it, but I'll send my football From what? picture. When From you were dancing, <laughs> you were a dancer. Blue down hike. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. We don't have to no, show the, vi the video. Picture. What what are you gonna? See? Yeah, NL the tour of how to smoke free base. No, you're supposed to send a picture of UNLV, which we know you don't have. <laughs> they posted one. You yeah. play baseball, so you're gonna send us a picture of your baseball. What play? All the sports. Well, whatever sport. <laughs> Did you play okay. baseball? Yeah. What position? Center field, back oh. catcher. I thought you played left out. He said, that's how you know he didn't Here's really play. He said, picture. back catcher. Oh, yeah, that was yeah, in the fight. Was there you go, Lou. <coughs> that's right. when I was in one of my fights. But I want to see the video. I want to see it the video. It looked like that stance. It looked like you got hit. No, nah, I was about to hit him with that left hand. Okay. Did, so wait a minute, did you, know? did you did, duck yeah. that right hand? Yeah, I stopped, I stopped him. Did you put that back up? So you caught him? Yeah, I knocked him out. Wait, what? the left hand looks like he's about to hit you. Nah, he's, it's not going to so hit. Did you move? No, nah, as you can see, I'm I'm, lung, I'm lunging in there. He's not really letting it go. He's kind of so. so see, Dan, do you feel himself. like you could have really made an? Okay, so him? really, nah. I, I no, I could have. Mm -hmm. uh, Jerry Page was willing to call the uh, Colorado Springs for me because I mm -hmm. sparred Jerry Page one time. We won the gold medal. What happened was I got invited down to Ray Leonard's gym, and Pepe Guerrero and then were looking at me. Mm -hmm. And but my last year in grad school, I was finishing up my thesis. Mm. So I finished my thesis and I was doing my my dissertation. Well, I finished my dissertation. I was finishing up my project. Whatever. And then, <laughs> and then what happened was I sparred two of Ray Leonard's Sugar Ray Leonard's sparring partners. Mm -hmm. And then the first day they beat me. They were they was on me, but I was nervous and I was you, you amateur. Didn't the question. No, I'm gonna tell you. Oh. So then what happened was, <laughs> Pepe Guerrero and them were said that they liked me, that they were willing to, to work with me, like to sign me. But I had to wait till Ray Leonard did his last fight, which was against Terry Norris. If y'all remember you that one, wait? because I was in school and I had to make. I said six oh, years of college. A true athlete. No, it's just like I didn't know if I want to give up six years of college to become a professional. I, I you could have been like Flavor Flav and went back and got your degree anytime. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, you could Jazz, back. You Jeff. Good, that was good, Jeff. You. But you know what? You got to be a boxer to be really a world champion. You have to want to live, eat, and drink it. And yeah. I didn't want to yeah, do that. Do All right. No, no pun intended. No pun intended. Right, look, I'm Lewis Dix. Speed dog. Oh, speed dog it out. All right, I'm Lewis Dix. Speed dog it out. Teeter. Jeff Arnold. Dan and Green. What's the name of the show? In a man's world. Tighten up your belt. Now, I haven't, I want to ask hmm? you, no, I want to ask boss lady. How's mom? She's doing fine. For tonight. Your brother? He's doing fine. That was him that left, right? <laughs> I think he was here. That was my younger brother. We oh, okay. did have a skateboard D. A scare this past week because um, oh. my brother found um, a lump in his chest. Oh. So um, he went and had it checked out and it was. It wasn't. Is he okay? okay? Yeah, he's fine. Oh. And, and how are you? I'm good. You, want, I'm good. you got a lump in you? You want us to come? <laughs> <laughs> you want Heaven some dick dope bismals? <laughs> <laughs> You're not feeling well. Yo, man, I could check. Hey, listen, uh, we have not. Big nose. What? What? Huh? We're just throwing out <laughs> stuff that's not right. <laughs> we want to say hello to uh, Seymour and Shout out to Seymour. Nikita. Seymour. Nikita. Oh, my Nikita. good friend, the ones that Nikita like me? Nikita from the Nikita. Bay. Nikita that likes me? Yeah, right. right. My boy, no tea. Um, my boy from uh, Jeremy from the DMV. Jeremy. Shout out, Jeremy. Uh, shout out to Bruce. Bruce. Yeah. Um, shout cool. out to Pickle. Bruce, shout out to Pick. Shout out to Pick. Mm -hmm. Bruce, uh, we appreciate you. That yeah, interview. Bruce, it was so funny because Bruce texted us the next day saying he had a oh, fun yes. time on the yeah, show. Yeah, let me, let me. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah. So, Bruce. Slow down, broad. <laughs> Bruce, no, because she's right. She's, uh, thank you. She's on the same page as I am. And Bruce did text us. She, he texted Poetus and myself and said that. Um, oh, yeah. Felt, no, no, it was interesting because I want to make sure I get it right. And, and I responded. Uh oh, look. Um, in a timely manner? 
Yeah, yeah, because I didn't, I, I wasn't happy about it. Mm. Um, he said, um, uh, yeah, hey, Lou and Poets, thanks again for having me on the show. I had fun, and if Speedy or any of the fellas wants to pitch a project, feel free to share my contact information. And Lewis said. And Poetis said, hey, Bruce, I was just about to text you. Thank you so much for being a part of the show. You are an amazing brother. Hmm. And I said, hey, Bruce, I'm not sharing anything with them until my show gets pitched first. Appreciate you and having so the time I hit him, show. Let it go, Lou. I hit him up and said, hey, brother. He said, yeah, well, let's talk tomorrow. I said, well, don't tell Louis. <laughs> That's funny. We did not get the information over here, did we, Jeff? So, he saw what he wrote. <laughs> so, uh, so uh, Bruce, that was really nice of you. What up, and Bruce? Fellas, uh, I'm just, I just felt a certain kind of way because I'm like, Dan is going to be the first one to get a show on. And so I was like, because he writes really I well. Got, I got one in the chamber. Do you? That's what we all say. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay. Okay. So, that's, so, Bruce, thank you for that invitation. Absolutely. Thanks, Bruce. Uh, we Appreciate you. We'll be getting to you stuff that I'm sure you Have won't pick up. Have any of you guys up. done a voice for animation? No. So I would like to. It's, it's dope as fuck. It's totally different than doing uh, commercials. So I did one with uh, Buddy Lewis, who is the, this nigga. As much as me and Buddy go at it, that motherfucker's the shit. Oh, yeah. Buddy is a shit. Uh, Johnny Mac has a animation Feathers. called uh, about some mi mice. One of them is named Speedy, but it's not about me. And uh, so Buddy goes, and I go there. We go there to do the voiceovers. I haven't done voiceovers mm. before, so Buddy goes first. This motherfucker destroys energy. Energy. I'm like, God damn. So the white guy comes out. Well, that was fucking good there, Buddy. Speedy, are you ready to get in there? I'm like, God. And Johnny Mac looking at me. I'm like. Okay, so I get it. I get that goddamn paper, and I, I mean, I just try to stay in his, because because it, it's about how you project and really make the... <laughs> Didn't we do your segment on right. yeah. here? How bad. you do it? it, it did yeah. you enjoy it? Loved it. I, I, yeah, I, don't get sick of that Did you kill? Did you kill? Yeah, you killed it. Yeah. Did you OJ it? it? <laughs> <laughs> Sliced him up. Who said that? Did you say that? Tita, Tita. Right, I thought it was too funny for you to say. Let's <laughs> <laughs> like, see if he's gonna lie. We're gonna, say, <laughs> we're gonna see how you gonna get to your rap party. <laughs> oh. um, I'm going that way. Um, before we go, <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> before we go, just want to thank the people who have donated to the show. Thank you so much. Please continue to donate. Shout out to Ernest Berry, to Dana Dorsey, to Prime Primo. Thank you to Jackie Welch. And to Lewis's friend, Mark, Mark Weiss. Weiss. Mark Weiss. 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 Damn, Thank you so name. much. Yeah, yeah, on a serious tip. For donating to the show. On we a appreciate tip, it. I, I know I, I, I say a lot, but uh, on a serious tip, Mark Weiss, you know how certain people you know who really mm -hmm. just help you and understand, because, you know, he's a Jewish guy mm -hmm. who just... What does that have to do anything? Well, because people don't realize that you can connect with people no yeah. matter where you're from. Exactly. And he, he took he took care of my family mm -hmm. and looked out for my son and my daughter, even though she became gay. Um, Damn. Who's what does that, that? Got to do? Wow. Nikia. Oh, Nikia. It's Nikia. pronounced Nikia. <clears throat> Nikia. What did I say? The wrong name? Kiki. Something. Nikia. Yeah. You know, Nikia, I love you, and I love your energy. Yeah. I want to thank Paul Lee. I don't. Coach D. Thank Poli. you so much for doing what you're doing. Uh, McVeigh, thank you. Uh, Gre uh, Greenwood, Goodwin. Was it Greenwood? I think it was Goodwin. I think it was Goodwin. Goodwin. Goodwood. I think it was Goodwood. I think it was Greenwood. No, it was Greenwood. It's Greenwood, Greenwood from Tulsa, boy. Oklahoma. Uh, thank you for uh, setting us off with a with a good call. Absolutely. And respect yes. to you and 25 years to your your dad's service. Thank you. Absolutely. And shout out to uh, Louis Gossett Jr.'s family, mm -hmm. uh, O.J. Simpson's family, yeah. and anybody whose family is not a celebrity, but you're feeling the pain. Uh, peace to your heart. And thank you, boss. Hopefully, we helped you through. Yeah, we're out. Thank All right, you. see you next week. Adios. Bye, big girls. <laughs>